Hello everyone, Vase of you, welcome to another Bodish stream. We're gonna be playing some more Final Fantasy 14. Everything looks very yellow. And that's probably because of these glasses. Eh, it's fine. But how's it going, Birch? What's going on, Lonnie? How you guys doing? Welcome to the stream. I was gonna start a little earlier, but I got caught up doing Etsy stuff, so. Holy crap, this thing. The lid on this shaker just look at that. Doesn't want to move. Need some lubrication. Ah, also, I did find out yesterday, er, today, uh, since I didn't drink all my sneak yesterday, I put it in the fridge and like super cold sneak. Oh, it's so good. Uh, so what I did today is I, I, I hyper chilled my water for the sneak and it's delicious. You like the shade sticks? Um, I bought them a long time ago and uh, I never wear them and they were not cheap so I need to get some use out of them but maybe I should just take them upstairs when I'm working I don't know I don't like how it feels like wearing glasses that don't block light you know like sunglasses I'm fine to wear but like these feel very weird and that like that's normal color that way but like looking through them is orange and yellow and it's weirding me out Anyways, um, also, I did move the mic a little bit closer. Um, hopefully that helps with the, the stream caption or stream, the stream caption, the uh, closed captions. It looks like it's already doing better. Um, at least a little bit. Uh, so you guys let me know how it is. Also, let me know if it's annoying. Seeing if it's too close, although it kind of looking at it right now, it kind of looks kind of cool. Oh, you can't see right there because doggo cam is covering it. But um, like right there, it, lo it looks like it provides some sort of depth. Right? It looks like it's like super zoomed in for you guys. I don't know. We're just playing. Also, I, I fixed Jada's bed, so hopefully she stays there for a bit. Cookie What's going on, Yuri? Welcome to the stream. Cookie time! Oh, Jada heard it. Jada heard the Yuri. You want them a cookie? Yum! I died for the turkey. Oh, that was not from... <gasps> another one from Lonnie. Want another cookie from Lonnie? You'll come get it. Yeah. Nom, nom, nom. Get him those cookies. You only wear light... You wear blue light glasses now. It helps your eyes a lot. These are uh, blue light blockers. That's why they're orange. Well, that's not necessarily mean why they're orange, but it seems like blue light filters are generally orange. Man, I don't like this lid. This lid fucking sucks. For being a, an elite... It's the elite one. I finally got my elite shaker. The lid kind of sucks. Yeah. But that is some tasty sneak. How you doing, Yuri? Um, let's see. So yesterday I hit 50. Huzzah. Um, if anyone wants to play, you're more than welcome to. Hey, Lava's online. Uh, location is in some tunnels. So looks like he's doing stuff. But, um, let's go do an escape from Castrum Sentry. <coughs> I don't know how long I'm going to wear these. Because it makes everything look... Makes everything look... Makes everything... Makes everything look goofy. There it is. My, my brain just, like, blue screen there for a second. <gasps> Seasoned adventurer. Hello. I gotta beat up this frog because he's yeah sneaky uh turn on rage mode why can't i select this frog oh i beg your pardon madam i seem to have bitten off a tad more than i can chew and could you just help help me a helping hand from a fellow adventurer i accepted a living quest to gather up abandoned rep supplies in the ruins of cap revenant's toad thinking all i would have to do is run in collect the items and sneak out did I, did I know, little did I know the place would be crawling with hungry gigantoads. How about this? I give you half of the Levy Quest reward in exchange for riding, ridding the area of the Nixes. All right, 51%. And I'll do the collecting. We have an accord? Sure. Uh, I'm... Hmm. Okay, that frog is bugged. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I forgot. No! That frog is 
talking. It's weird. I forgot about these freaking frogs exploding and sucking me in. Ah! Stop it. Boom. Stop. Oh god, this is annoying. Stop it. Alright, let's just try to take one at a time. Oh, one died. Kill me. Or something's killing him. Something's doing a lot of damage and it's not me. Is it me? I'm confused. Hey. <gasps> Storm's eye. Alright, that's the thing I got. Oh, what is this? <gasps> oh, right. That's the new thing I got. Kick him. Heck off. Haha. -ha! How you like them apples? Bonk. I need to bonk. Oh, that's fucking cool looking. All right, I dig. It's taking forever. Ups and downs. You doing all right, my dude? Hope you're doing okay. You may join with homework. All right, make sure you be responsible first. Of course. Ah. Why can't I fucking? Hey. How can you? Yeah, that's unfortunate. I wonder when they're going to implement that. Might be able to look that up when they're going to allow anyone from any realm to play together. That's pretty cool. Stop. I did something. Fuck yeah. You like them apples. Yep, there it is. There's a third. Toads. There we go. Jeez. Oh, maybe there was another person. Showed up. Fat cat. You tried gladiator and you don't like it? Oh. You don't like to spin to win? Spin to win. Escape. Good to be bud. Is that the one that I did yesterday with Rooster? I'm guessing it is. Is it the baby morbles? Let me alone. Fuck. It is. Alright. Gotta fight this motherfucker because he's an asshole. Get me out, please. Stop it. What? I was supposed to stop that. Nope, no effect. It's fine. Why did I do that move? That was dumb. It's fine. Kick. How dare. It's fine. I'll just eat it. Kill him first. Bummer. Oh. 
Maybe it did work. Okay, so I gotta put on... Oh, I was gonna switch my clothes. Huh? <gasps> Hello. Right. I forgot. Hold on. Oh, dip. Oh, so much better than what I'm wearing. I gotta wear that. And I gotta wear... That. Alright, do I got... Oh, look how close that is for my spirit bond. Fucking that stupid thing. Oh, fuck you, dude. I was going to go through all my spirit bond equipment or my equipment here to see if I have anything fully spirit bonded. I forgot. Get out of here. Uppercut. 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 Do it again. Four uppercuts in a row. Love that. Still alive? Here you are. Alright. Extract materia. Oh, there's one. I thought I was supposed to set it back to zero. That one got set back to one. That was weird. Dude. Fucking this thing spawns too quickly. I'm not here. Leave me alone. I haven't moved. I'm just extracting my materia. Holy crap. A lot of these. Had stuff in them. Ooh. Battle dance materia. Sorry, we're gonna do this for a hot second. As long as this thing isn't attacking me, I think we're fine. I wish you could, like, extract all. That'd be... Kind of nice. Also, I fucked up my uh, baby levels because I keep thinking the uh, the little symbol here that looks like a piece of paper means it's part of a set. It's not. So I accidentally got rid of a bunch of stuff that I did not want to get rid of. So a lot of my baby levels are broken again. Also, we're going to have to clear out some room because we got some new items in my inventory that are pretty dope. My inventory is getting... I literally have like seven spots left open in my inventory. Oh, fuck off. I have to equip those because they're one away. This guy just leave me alone because I haven't moved. He's like a... a Tyrannosaurus. You can't see if you don't move. Look at all this materia. I'm losing... Oh, fuck. Losing inventory space by extracting all these materias. Monk, though? You like Monk? I didn't get monk too high. I was kind of like meh about it, but also I'm not a DPS player, so. But he seemed like he would be fun. All right, I gotta fight this thing. See if I can just finish out this thing real quick. Kick. Be dead? Nope. Alright, how are the gloves? 99. 
Gotta fight a couple things because my brain tells me to. What's up, Rooster? Welcome to the stream, my dude. Have to take a nap before work. Oh, did yeah, I, I saw I logged in. I saw you were uh you were in some sort of tunnel or something. Come on. Oh, I should be I should be using the other one. Storm's eye. Because it increases my damage. The other one. Because I don't really need to be healing right now. Oh, I should probably bring out my chocobo too. And drink my juice. still I was trying out the near uh, automata uh, raid I heard that was a, a fun fight Come on. Will it not level up because they're not within my level range? Is that it? If anyone knows the answer to that question, feel free to let me know. Uh, if Spirit Bond, they have to be a certain level range away or something. It is, but it's almost like a bullet hell game. Yeah, well, that's there's a lot of that in the air, so kind of makes sense. Fuck. Actually, won't it tell me? It'll tell me when they level up, right? Or I reach full spirit bond. You need to come over here. Good nap, my dude. Appreciate you popping in. Thank you, Chocobo, for the heal. Also, I should check my Chocobo. To see if, uh... He's leveled up.
Come on. Spear bond. I need you. Oh, come on, dude. Should I just go? I should just go do the quest, shouldn't I? That might get it for me finally. I thought it would be quick. Apparently not. Yeah, still got a minute. Forgive me for saying so, but you look rather fine in Imperial Black and Crimson. Definitely your colors. Ha! <laughs> but now is not the time for jest. Let's review the infiltration plan. Cash from Sentry lies just beyond. A short while ago, an Imperial Patrol left to do its rounds. Alpha Nodna will create a diversion out here and keep them occupied for as long as we are able. Meanwhile, the three of you will enter the stronghold, posing as the patrol returning from duty. Should Alpha and I, and I prove less distracting than hoped, I will contact you via Link, sp Link Speak. That's what I almost, almost said. Link Pearl, be ready to beat a hasty. Be ready to beat a hasty retreat. I kind of wish they fist bumped. He's just gonna chuck him. Oh, right. Thought he was just gonna throw him over the wall. Wedge will lead the way in the Reaper. Stay close to him. And I hardly need to tell you this, but don't do anything suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Oh, and lest, lest you wonder, Ida and Yastola left shortly before you arrived. We had planned that they should linger in the vicinity to cover our retreat in the event that Alpha and Anna attracted too much attention. But the approach of an Imperial vehicle forced us to improvise. Don't be too disappointed. They at least have a... They did at least leave a message for you. Something along the lines of don't do anything reckless if memory serves. Nice words. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. All right. The Imperial Patrol should be returning any moment now. You'd best be off. Good luck, Faith. May the 12 keep you. That's right. Also, part of me, I keep forgetting, I want to, like, you see how the doggo cam is kind of skewed inwards? I kind of want to do that with this cam, and when I'm small, skew it the other way. Maybe it'll look like I'm looking into the game. I just keep forgetting to do it. I always remember when I'm going to bed. Ugh. Hey! You have spirit. That I will allow. Yet you struggle to the benefit of none. Least of all, yourself. Now, Keith. This echo of yours intrigues us. We desire only to understand it. Sure you do. And for that, we need your help. No help you for me. to be rid of the icons, do you not? You would have saved yourself a great deal of torment had you accepted our aid from the beginning. Rude. I was watching Kim play God of War last night. Damn it. Now I want I really want to buy it for PC again. Tell me everything. And I, or, I really want to buy it for PC to play it again. That's it. Refuse. And though you beg for death, you shall not have it. Which will it be? A 
As you wish, my dear Minfilia. Unpleasant though it will be for all concerned, you leave us no choice but to employ more rigorous methods of study. Be so kind as to deliver the prisoners to Castrum Meridianum. Yes, my lady. The other day when I yelled at Hades, and I threw it on my back, it's still thrown out. Ugh. Whimper moan. Don't be suspicious. I'm fine. What's up, dudes? Just uh, here checking out this uh, robot. I'd best get back to my duties. The supplies aren't going to move themselves, and neither are the prisoners. Come to that. Wait, what? Perform an imper oh. Imperial salute. Hiya! Oh, my apologies. I didn't notice you there. So engrossed was I in my task. You'd be engrossed too. Had the tribunus commanding you to arrange for the prisoners to be transported. What prisoners do I speak of? You mean you haven't heard? Only the infamous signs of the Seven Dawn. Captured by the Tribunus herself. If you don't believe me, have a look in the storage tower when you next pass that way. Just giving out all the info. Part of the maintenance crew for... Er, part of the maintenance queue from Austin's, are you? I don't know what they teach you over there, but being an engineer does not exempt you from saluting your superiors. Right, I forgot to do that. Imperial salute. Salute. I feel better. Hmm, that's a fine salute. Part of the maintenance crew from the Ossidans, are you? We just said that. Welcome to Castrum Sentry, engineer. What? Prisoners? Ah, you've heard the rumors then. Yes. They're being held in the storage tower, but I strongly suggest you pay them all no mind. You were summoned here to work, not to gop at Eorzea's defeated heroes. Now, show a bit of enthusiasm, or I'll have you reported. Don't report me, bro. What are you doing just hanging out here? Hala! What's up? Greetings, comrade. Forgive me for asking, but you haven't visited the storage tower recently, have you? I only asked because I dropped something in there and, um... Ah, who am I fooling? I've fallen for one of the prisoners, all right? I dare say you know the one I mean. Eh? The Svelte. The Svelte Blonde. Goodness, no. It's a Lala Felon lass I'm smitten with. She's so adorable, it hurts. I want to sweep her up in my arms and squeeze her through my arms ache. What do you reckon I would do? Would take to convince the Centurion to lend me a key so I can see her? Creep. Okay, I did the thing. Perform on the Centurion. Where are you? There you are. Hello, I'm down here on the train tracks. What's this? You need access to the storage tower. What business have you there? At the tribunus behest, you say? This is highly irregular, but it would not do to make my lady worse. Take my identification key. See that it is returned when your errand is concluded. Just fucking give it. All right, bro. Hey, you want a key, dude? I found you a key. Security's tight. Just as expected. We're going to need a special key if we want to get past the bulkhead. Got one. Here you go. Yay! We did it. He cheered again. He's very excited. Later, bros. Infiltration success. Now what? Examine the steel door. This one? The big shiny one? Big shiny one with the glowies? Shit. 
I'm in bad armors and stuff. I'm gonna get my ass kicked. Oh, yeah, just squinch them, squatch them. No! And Philia and the rest, thank goodness they're safe. I am the one you want. Leave the others be. If you want my friends, I swear I shall take my own life and you shall answer to your mistress. Oh, damn. Papa Limo. You got your staff? Can't you cast some magics or something? Be views. Yay, it's friend. Oh, she's cute. We must do something. We rest letting the entire cash from nowhere here. Don't worry, I got it. I, uh, you're right. We may not get a better chance. Buckle up, bitches. This is the third squadron. What is it? A Reaper seized when? And this came to light only now? Oh, that's right, because we shut down their communications. The culprits have left a trail. Take as many men as you need and scour the area. I want the Reaper found. Now's the chance. Oh, that was funny. Hey, look, you found it. What the? Strike my last. It's got flames on it. it gives a plus 10 attack power. Eliminate the intruders. Stomp. Let's go, bitches! Anger mode activate. I right, gotta pop all my things because they're gonna hurt my damage. What are you getting chained on? What the hell is this? Let go of me. Heck you, bro. Oh, you're still alive. All right, you get dead. Bonk. Eat this. Boom! Leave my Reaper friend alone. Tiny little feats. It was foolish of you to come here. You might have been killed. But thank you. I shudder to think what might have happened had you not arrived when you did. I say, did you not see Thanquid anywhere? I'm beginning to fear for the fellow. He's the betrayer. Olinga so here shall yield us no answer. Let us away ere the window to our liberty closes shut. What did you say? Escaped? And recapture them, Phil, and I shall have your head. And what have we here? Yo, is Tola gonna fucking box her down? The Tribunus herself, just as you said. You have the eye of an Araman, Yita. Oh, she behind you? She's going to take them both on to show how bad she is. Well, she's kind of hard to miss in that showy armor of hers. Accursed scions, how did you slip our defenses? With, une with unexpected ease, if truth be told. Their chance to be a commotion outside the cast from walls, which allowed us to avail ourselves of the comforts of your vehicle. Rachel is not being polite. 
That was one of the most uncomfortable things I've ever stowed away in. It's no wonder it's called the Phantom Train. No passenger would be seen dead on it. So you scuttled in amidst the freight, like the vermin you are. I shall be sure to have words with our rat catcher. Such negligence is unforgivable. That is far from your most pressing concern. First, you must answer for your own wrongdoing, Livia Sun Sons Junius. It was you who led the raid on the Waking Sands. You who butchered on our men and men women for the crime of being unworthy of capture. Kill with our friends. We'll never forgive you. Nor shall we suffer you to a plague Eorzea a day longer. We take you to your guard. Why fucking let her a chance to... Or arm herself. Or Junus, protect the Tribunus! And found it. Ida, with me. Are you guys just gonna retreat just with three fucking guards? Yep, yeah, I was gonna say, she's got a gun on hers. Okay. After them! Hi. Where is his excellency? In the hangar, my lady. In discussion with our guest. Alert him at once! Yes, my lady. His helmet is goofy, makes him look like a duck. Punch. No. No, no, no! Aww. Sucks to be you. There they are! Fan out and surround him! You're about to get your ass kicked. Oh, you're really about to get your ass kicked. Hey, go go be several safe. Pick her up! Us. Protect. Toss her room. Eggs. I'm going in. See everyone to safety. Oh, I think he like likes her. No oh, wedge, don't do it. Or it's his sister. I don't know. Oh no, face. Hold them off. I'll look after Minvili and Tataru. All right. I got this. Don't you worry. Team Awesome is here. Except Papalimo. He's just here because we need him here, apparently. With some bitches. Oh, here goes. Boom. Vulnerable. Oh, Mr. Healer Man, I see you. Oh, he just he just died straight up. Okay. Hey. What are you doing over here? Get off my friend. I can't attack him. It's not dying. I'm vulnerable. Can I not fight this thing? I don't like that at all. Am I missing something here? Why is he invulnerable? This is annoying. Why is he invulnerable? Defeat the enemy and escape. Yeah, this guy is fucking... Literally can't do damage to him. Is this a bug? Hello? 
Um, maybe there's something. Hey guys, what the fuck are you doing over here? Um, it was a motherfucking sneaky dude. Motherfucker, you were bugged out, stuck somewhere. You're annoying. All right, can I hit you now? Nope. Um. Dude. What the fuck? I literally can't do anything to him. Um. Oh shit, hello. Aha! Get the fuck out of here. Haha! -ha. I wish they would have. They would have said something. Maybe they did. Oh my god, he's getting his ass kicked now. I wish they would have said something like, "Hey, the met. He's he's being guarded." Oh shit! Hello. invulnerable bullshit. Hey, motherfucker. Yeah, fuck you. You're dead. Alright. So is that both of them down? Or do I gotta do one each? Marked on my map? No. Here we go. Did you not miss these quests? Yeah, this. They didn't even warn you that there was a thing. You just couldn't hurt the dude. What's going on, Josh? Welcome to the stream, my dude. Did someone stun him? Good job. Oh my god, another one. Oh shit, that's a big dude. Look. Thank you. Are you invulnerable? You're not. Good god. You're gonna eat shit, Duro. Boom. 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 Get wrecked. No, 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 no. That's right. My God. Finally. Things based on Josh have both said. <laughs> Did you say that too? <laughs> or are you making another dirty joke? Another dirty Josh joke. Run! Take the leader! Kill the rest! That voice is kind of close to him. Denied, bitches. What the? The Astola. Pray, forgive us our delay. Oh! 
Oh, get him! Get him, get him, get him! Fuck yeah, dude. Papalino! Minthilia! Ida! Hey! The gang's so all here. At the club a while ago, not now. <laughs> the reunion must wait. Reunion. Right. Genova. First. Yes, let's get back to being heavily outnumbered. You ditched your Magitek armor. Fool of a Lalafell. He's Scottish. Well, excuse me. She's all yours if you think you can do any better. Okay, they have voices now. Mine were not close at all. Yeah! Friend robot. Must protect. There's no one in there. Friend robot. This is Sid. Can you hear me? I hear you, Sid. I need you to count to five. I love how she uses that ability when it's an astrologian astrologian ability. I mean she's a special person, or does she actually have a dedicated class? One, two, three, ah, ah, three, ah. four. What the fuck? What was the point of counting? No! Now my robot friend is not going to trust anyone. We just abandoned her. Which is more pitiful, the charlatans who rule Eorzea, or the toilet paper I store in my bathroom being one ply? The masses that clamor for their implausible panaceas. I see that which they cannot. This realm. I see dead people. With true power, the power to cast down icons. If you continue to deny this truth. It is the people who will suffer. Embrace reason. Oh! Laser beam. What in the seven hells? Ah, you know, we gotta leave that. No. It's... Twelve preserve us. They finished it. I was right. Ultima I knew it was Ultima Weapon. So it has a name. It does now. She's technically a white mage. Ida is a pugilist. Thancred is thief. Prior to the thief release, he was a gladiator. Yuri Anger is summoner. Don't know who that is. Happily Mill is black mage. Is this a boss battle? Heck yeah, dude. It is a relic of ancient Alag. Excavated from its resting place deep beneath Alamigo. The Alagans used it to crush primal and foe alike. And now the Garlians mean to do the same. Damn you, Gaius. Look! There! Beside the Black Wolf! <laughs> An Asian. It's that dude! An overlord, no less. His garb attests to that. I made a, a new set today of dice. It's in the pressure pot. I'm hoping it's going to be like an arcane set. And the, the resin overflow looked really fucking cool. So even if it doesn't turn out the way I wanted, if it looks like what it looked like when with the resin overflow, it'd be a dope ass set. La Habrea. It could only be him. I'm excited to see what they do tomorrow. Also, I did get notified finally like 20 days after. Okay, why you gotta be hot? Um, Thancred. Like 20 days after, because Moira's thing, dice got sent bad to me. Finally, 
After 20 days, there was an update, and it landed in Denver, so I should get them soon, so I can send them back out to him. But I, I made two, I made a, in case I didn't get him back, I was like, all right, preemptively make some new sets for him. So I made one, and it, it looked similar to the other one, but the, the colors were too separated. It looked like purple was stacked on top of gold more than it, it being, like, swirly, uh, like the first one. So I was like, all right, we'll try again. So I did a dirty pour, and the new one turned out worse. They, they're like a, it's just like a, a dark, a dark gold color. So, because, you know, purple and yellow, when they mix, they turn brown. But it's interesting because when you just look at them, they're like a swirly, like, gold, right? But the, uh, the, I don't even know what you, the off faces, I guess. So, like, say you're looking directly at the 20, right? You're looking directly at it. The faces next to it have, like, a purple color. But then you'll turn it and look at, so say, say, like, a 16 was next to the 20. So the 16 would be like a purple sheen. But then you turn it to the 16 and it's gold. So it kind of has a cool effect, but the direct color is kind of lame. So, um, but it could be because they just need polish because that really seems to help bring out the colors better. But it's interesting. So I got a, I got a lot of sets to polish. And also I over poured some resin. So I have two sets of the one the first one I tried to do for Moira, I have two different sets. One with like the sharp edge dice, one with rounded. And then the second set I made with the dirty pour with the one I was just explaining. And I think I have another set too. I just can't remember what it is. I don't know. Biggest plot twist ever, Invasive doesn't even care. I don't even know who Sancred is. So, so I don't. What's up, Pancake? Welcome to the stream. Jada Mono Kogi! Jada. Jada. Hey, yo. Hey. Jada. One does cookie. Jada. Oh, she better get it. Nom, 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 nom. Ancred is one of the Scions. He's been with you since the beginning. Has he? Have I met him not as Mr. Man? Like, I don't even recognize him. See, I recognize that that sign of Mr. Man that's been watching me, but I don't know who Thancred is. No, this cannot be. Yeah, I knew him as Lana Brea. Or La Habrea. Because he's always been like, Oh, you've been doing... I see you took down different... But I don't know who Thancred is. Thancred's literally been in there since, like, your first few quests. Really? In his normal outfit. All right, let me look him up. Than cred. Don't recognize him at all. Who the fucker is this guy? Zero recollection of who this guy is. I can't even find a cutscene with him that I recognize him. YouTube. Overtime. Overtime. This is Thancred. Hey, listen. I'm worried that those are going to be uh, spoilers. Cookie so I'm not going to look at it. I was able to acquire chocolate Castilla cake. What is that? It sounds delicious. You need to restart your game? Hell no, dude. I'm too deep into it. Spoilers, spoilers in the Google. Okay. I didn't see any. I, I was just looking at image search to see if I could see, like, his outfit. Alert, timer, overtime. <laughs> Josh, are you panicking? <laughs> Spoiler panic. I appreciate it. There you go. Got to listen. Jada, what them cookies? And get them that cookie. Get them. Um. I like throwing him at her now because she has to like make an effort. The outfit I saw where, where he was just in a white outfit. But yeah, I don't recognize him at all. You gotta remember I've been playing for like eight months. Very on and off. Like once every couple months. <laughs> just 
play for eight hours. Japanese cake, it's moist and delicious. We have to go now. Hang on. I'll have to look it up. Uh, Josh, cracking me up. Dude, I love the panic. Alert, timer, overtime. Listen. <laughs> I don't know what to do. We can get attention now. Fucking Ingrid. hilarious. No. Is that her boyfriend? <laughs> but he's a member of the Scions. Wait, I did say that as a joke earlier. I was like, but where's Than Creator? I was like, he's the betrayer, isn't he? I don't even know who he was. All that time, the enemy was beside me, and I never even suspected. And to think that it was I who suggested that Thancred investigate the Asians. <sighs> How could I have been so blind? Love is blind, bitch. Ow, I broke my hand. Small wonder the enemy knew our every move and where to find us. Confounded all. Yeah, I'm surprised you guys didn't figure out you had a mole sooner. No. No, this is not the time for self-doubt. The Alliance leaders stake their hopes on the Scions, but now they believe us all... Can dead. we switch to the sister... soon? Because I don't like Alphanod. When they learn of the Empire's new weapon, we cannot be certain what they will do. We must go and offer them what assurances we can that defeat is not inevitable. Alice, is that is that his sister's name? She's a badass. I'm all for it. I agreed with her. I think more than him. She at least seemed cooler. Ill turn. But the battle is far from over, and so long as we stand together, should they be talking over each other like that? People of Eorzea falter for want of such hope. Let us provide it. It's pronounced Alphinia. Alphino? Oh, him. I was like, Alice is not pronounced Alphino. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> really? I thought I swore Minfili called, called him Alphinod. Matters are coming to a head. I hope we can count on you. <laughs> My regards to grandfather. I really like her voice actress. Very calming. I am ready. Let us pay a visit to the Council of the Alliance leadership. Hills take the black wait. I forgot his voice. Hills take the black wolf and his new toy. Oh, well, then. Finally, all available. Whoa, no, thank you. No, 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 no. Finally, all available forces. I want them ready to move upon my word. And we like to slap. Slafferson, fucking, the order to sail. That is all. The maelstrom set stands ready. What of the flames? It is where like to be. I need only give the word to roll. Royal of. Fucking names, bro. Hey, it's you. I remember you. You're the special lady in forest area. Has there been no word from Ishgard? None. The dragons have got their tongues. Silent to the last. I was unwise to hope for better. What would stir the archbishop to open his holy mouth if not this? And he claims the fury of the, his god. It's bad comedy. Hello. You're small. The Holy See has made its choice. We will proceed without its cooperation.
Speaking of, what is that, muffin top? She's got a whole cake. No, cake is ass. She's got a whole bakery of muffin. I believe we are all acquainted with the terms of the Black Wolf's ultimatum. We must agree upon a course of action. Not less than the fate of Eorza hangs upon the decision of this council. I brought my favorite drawing. An Balthar claims to wield the power to smite primals. Should we yield to him, he pledges to rid the realm of its false gods. Yet offer resistance and he swears that we shall we share the primal's fate. Pardon my bluntness. But I like not these choices. This is too great of a decision for any one of our nations to make alone. Well, what, her name showed up and my brain just blended the word or the letters together and I thought it said Naruto for a second. Choose we surrender our resistance, we must answer as one. For it be or if what but one surrenders, the rest shall surely fail. Let us pray for the wisdom to do right by all our peoples. Oh snap. We're all united in one front. You're all fucked. Did my things finish? Fuck! Sancred's plight troubles us all, yet we cannot allow anything to come between us and our goal. So long as the Ultima weapon exists, Aeorze will never know peace. Let us go to the Alliance leader's face and help them to make the right decision. Okie dokie. Grim Tidings faith. It seems the word of the Ultima weapon's existence has already reached the Alliance leaders. Someone took him out! Yo! Serio! Let's go. Let's goo. Let's not. Josh is in chat. There will be no gooing. There will be no gooing. Did it work? Yo. Nope, it didn't work. What? Yo! And the tune. All hail, new stream bot serial. Thank you so much for the 45 months, my dude. Almost four years, that's amazing. Want a cookie? Some cake up on them. Cookie. Also, everyone, congratulations. I don't know. Can I tell people, Cereal, are you good for everyone to know? I I'm, I'm going to let you answer that first. Also, Cereal, there is a new thing uh, added to the stream. If you are uh, the stream boss, once per stream, you get to make some sort of a, a decision with the gameplay. Go ahead. Yo, everyone, Cereal. And his lady, Miss Creation, just had their baby boy this morning. Uh, afternoon, well, my time. And he's a small, cute bean. So everyone go give them all your loves and all your congratulations. It's super exciting. I, uh, I tweeted something this morning. Like, I was just kind of thinking back. And I was like, man, it's interesting in the, the day and age that we live right now. Here, we're, we're going to switch for a second. The day and age we live right now because oops i clicked a thing and it passed the thing but it's fine um because you can meet people online right and form friendships and stuff like that and then i was like yeah that's cool because like i met serial obviously on twitch and then uh i was like and then we, we we all became friends and then we decided we all made like a D, &D group and the cool thing about D, &D is like it brings people together right for, for the most part you know there, there's some bad D, D groups and bad experiences out there but for the most part D, D is like a uniting force and it's cool because i was like man i've never met these people actually in real life the only me meeting of them i've done is like through discord calls and you know th through the internets of just cameras but like we got pictures of the new baby boy because we're all like this close-knit like family now and it's like man fucking I wanted to give like all the the credit to D&D, which I think probably is like 70% of it. But man, I fucking love D&D. So good. So good for community. I suggest you use that power to make base to start a new character so you can relearn that and crit. 
Um, also, so there is a stipulation to that rule. I think it's, um, there's a command. I forgot it was. It's like exclamation point stream boss or something like that. There it is. Activate channel. The oh yeah. Or you can get a free channel point redemption. That's what I forgot. Oh yeah. And you use power word. So like if you do power word and then whatever you want, it'll like make a notification or sound effect so I know like a stream boss power got activated. But essentially it's like you can't derail my the whatever I'm doing too much. So like if someone were to be like, hey, I, I would never do this, but say I was doing like a, uh, a no death run in like a Bloodborne or something and I got really far and, and then the stream boss was like, hey, you have to die. But like, no, that, dis that derails way too much. Fuck that. <laughs> you know what I mean? We started the D&D &D campaign to fight the first quarantine boredom. Now we're... Dude! And it's cr like... Th well, for one, like, the quarantine is the longest running campaign I've been a part of. And it's funny because, like, it did start just as, like, a joke of, hey, we'll play for uh, during quarantine and stuff like that. And we're still technically kind of in a, in a quarantine. It's, it hasn't gone away, and it's, like, three years later. Yeah, there you go. More powerful. Oh, crap. I'm going to click back in the game. Oh, wait. I can read this first. Hold on. Believe it as they are, I fear they may, may well elect to lay down their arms in the belief that surrender will spare the people untold suffering. Yet nothing can be further from the truth. That which the Black Wolf offers will doom Eorzea, not deliver it. And the leaders must be made aware of this. Let us hurry to them, Faith, and ensure they do not act in ignorance of the consequences. Also, Serial, I don't know if you're aware, but, uh, uh, cross-world play is coming to 14. So no matter where you're at, or what server group you're in, you're, you're gonna be able to freely jump server groups to go play with anyone. So that's gonna be cool. So we all can play together. Hey, Pancake, thanks for contributing to the, the R2-D2. That was partially Serial's idea, actually. We were all talking about Legos in his stream. And so I went and took a picture of all the Legos that I have that are unbuilt. And he's like, is that an R2-D2? And I was like, fuck yeah. So I decided to make it a, a channel point redemption. Speak with Bartholomew. Okay. Chamber of Rule. That's what I call my bedroom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me in. I always forget how to get out of here. I have to talk to one of you. Yes. Thought it was when you were ranting about healthcare. That could have been it. I don't remember. Everything kind of gets mixed up in my brain now. That was a fun discussion, though. We were, uh, we were making everyone else outside of the U.S. have many, many anxiety attacks just by explaining our shit healthcare system here in the U.S. And making all, everyone else be like, damn. Glad we don't live in the U.S. We're about to have a baby. Go in debt for fucking having a baby. How much it costs for me to have baby tonight? There you go. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, dude, uh, you should tell everyone about your uncle and how many how many babies he has, because that's funny. The council of the alliance leaders is presently in progress in the fragrant chamber. I must ask you to step away from the doors, madam. Uh, I'm sorry. You're here on behalf of the signs of the seventh dawn. A thousand pardons, my lady. Of course, you may enter. A fragrant chamber. That sounds like a sex room or a drug room ah, or both. We keep treading the same ground. They're talking this time. Van Belsar's demands are clear. Not only is it free in Canada, you get money from the government until the turn turns eighteen. Fuck. Uh, Cereal was telling us that if you have a baby in a store, like in, the baby is born in the store. You get free shit from the store until they turn 18. 
That's bananas. All the stuff they were telling us, like, are you serious? That's a thing? And here in America, it's like, nope, we're going to make sure we squeeze if every living penny out of these fucking peasants. And they get nothing. They get scraps. There's a, there's a, kind of reminds me, there's a new thing going on Twitch for, like, sponsorships, right? Where a, a company will approach you. For example, we'll say a chair company. Uh, this is the one I've been seeing going around. Is a, a chair company comes to you and it's like, hey, we're looking... We're wondering if you're interested in a partnership, keyword partnership, right? Essentially, we will give you a chair at a discounted price. Not give you a chair, give you a chair at a discounted price. You have to have our uh, our logo or whatever up on your stream, every stream for the whole stream. You have to do two or three announcements of the company during your stream, depending on how long you stream, I think. And uh, you need to do explicit, like, social media posts about them, like on Instagram or something. And there's some other bullshit stuff. And I'm like, how is that a partnership? You guys are... M you don't know what the word term partnership, then. If that's a partnership, no. That, what that is, that's actually... M that's not a partnership. That is a, a business employee like discount that's what that is that's literally like they hired you and you work for the company you just get discounts on their products that is not a partnership fuck you company horrible so don't fall for that anyone that's being offered this shit don't fucking fall for that if you get offered any sort of partnership ask how much it pays and if they say that oh there's no pay you say fuck off like i know that's that's hard thing to think about and like I've I've always even I don't know up until fairly recently last couple of years I'm like I don't know man like if like Elgato came through me and offered me something like that it's like oh yeah that'd be kind of cool I wouldn't op be like oh they don't need to pay me I, I like their products I'll use it if they send me stuff whatever that's fine but like if they would have offered me something like that I'd be like I get a discount and I have to do shout outs and actually do more work and I don't get paid for it no fuck that dude no that's not a partnership. That is literally a company and employee business transaction. That is what's happening there. Fuck you, company. Sorry, catching up on chat. Yeah, Universal Healthcare. I don't... Oh, yeah, I read that. Oh, yeah. Serial's uncle has 18 kids. And he has a sex, as or sex asbo. Anyone here in the Amer Americas and stuff, if you don't know what an asbo is, it's antisocial behavior order. And he's not allowed to have sex past 10 p.m. As he is too noisy. That's fucking so funny. <laughs> imagine, imagine, I don't know how old your uncle is, but, but admit, like, imagine bringing someone home from like a club or your new partner or something and be like, hey, shit, it's like 9.45, fuck, we got to wrap this up. Or if we were planning to do anything, we better get to it because <laughs> I'll get arrested. That's fucking hilarious. Oh my god, that's hilarious. If you have your baby on the bus, the kid gets free travel until 18. That's bananas. Oh yeah! Oh, and that's the best part about that story. The fucking... His uncle was in a magazine about it. <laughs> that's so fucking hilarious. Oh my god. Oh, I can't. <laughs> is it like does he fucking like dinosaur roar i don't even want to know but i'd want to know you know just like just bah! just fucking how do you get like a court ordered you can't do this because you're so fucking loud get some soundproofing in your house or something duct tape around the face something like the government had to step in and be like, you are not allowed to do the sexy things beyond this time at night. That's fucking hilarious. Oh, can you, if that happened in America, can you imagine the uproar? Fucking government stepping in on my, what I do in my bedroom is my business. It's like, huh, you're catching on now, are you? Mr. Anti-gay people. Catching on. Who gives a shit what they're doing? Stop thinking about what they're doing in their bedroom, you fucking pervert. What they do in their bedroom is their business. Their business, not yours. Same thing. Fuck off. Anyways, that's my rant. And Belisar's demands are clear. Oh wait, this is voiced right now. Alas, 
Our minds are not. Fucking hypocrisy of some people, dude. It's been it's mind boggling. I've never been one to shy from a fight, but if this weapon of theirs can do all they claim, but it's against the Bible. Okay, well, wearing fucking two different types of fabric is against the Bible. And I see you wearing jeans and cotton. Better go confess your sins. Yo, masses. Five years since Can't cherry pick what you want. And our people have scarce begun to rebuild their lives. Can we now, in good conscience, call upon them to risk what little they have left? I don't know if I've said this before, but I would spare that's a lot of hair hanging on the back right there. That's gotta that's gotta be heavy. Conflict, that's gotta I cause say. neck problems. So that would imply forces set in opposition. Shaving is not allowed in the Bible. Nice Mark's smooth face you have there, heathen. <laughs> That's funny. What meaningful resistance can we offer? Long have we fought the primals, but to what end? We strike them down at no small cost. I want to see her fight. Only She's probably a badass. Again and again. She kind of looks like a super saiyan. Like with her hair, like I can imagine her go fury mode and also in her hair go and like grow. Are we to play Am I alone with that? Game for the rest of her eyes days. go cat mode. Just... I for one grow tired of it. Mistake me not. I do not propose to trade one. Serial, by the way, did you see a God of War got released on PC? I love liberty. That and Horizon. That Definitely recommend, my dude. Need not mean oppression. By the I mean, I know you just had a baby and, you know, expenses are going to be a priority with the baby. But uh, in case you didn't know, those games are uh, top notch. And they are on PC now. You picked up God of War on Steam? Hell yeah, dude. It's, it's, uh, it's real good. I'm probably gonna have to pick it up here one of these days. Refugees flood our gates and beast. Because I want to see it in all its quality glory at 60 frames. Do nothing. My flames struggle to bear the burden. Gonna stream it once you're done with the seven remake. Did you not beat the seven remake? I kinda because you switched over like uh, Overwatch and stuff, I kinda assumed that you had finished it when I wasn't in yet. You want to see Kratos nipples in nice 4k? Yeah, he's got that nice dad bod for you, huh, Josh? He's got them sausage fingers, bruh. Like when he when he grabs the Atreus's face, his thumb is like a, a half of a, the kid's face. Giant ass fingers. You want to enjoy it? Oh, I, I understand. I did everything you could. All the side quests. I'm just glad I didn't miss the the dance the dance off. That part is our fucking glorious. Chapter eleven. Then got the DLC to do after. I thought you did the DLC first. I might be getting getting you confused with something else. So someone else is doing it. Our enemy condemns us for failing our people. You are shooketh. Yeah. That whole sequence is. It fucking nailed it. There's there's a few key sequences in seven that it's like y'all can't fuck this up, and that that's one of them. And in my opinion, they fucking nailed it. it was so good. To rebuild their lives, the black it blew away my expectations. Of murder with which to end them. I should probably be paying attention to this, or Josh is gonna get mad at me again. The people's well-being has ever been our foremost priority. While none among us ever doubted that the Empire would one day resume its war, we scarcely had means enough to solve the problems of the present. I, which is why Laugh we the bee club cloud. <laughs> safeguard our future. The science so of the good. Alas, Cloud, you look... Yes, I know. Nailed it. Moving on. Old. Fucking slays me. Every time. I will go into people's stream playing that game. Like, alright, where are they at? It's like, oh shit, they're next to that stream. Like, even if I don't know and never seen them play. Or don't even know their channel. Like, if they're near that part, I will fucking wait. 
Yes, nailed it. Moving on. Fucking kills me every time. I fear you are mistaken. Alphanod? Aha! Amphilia I'm right, Josh! Someone clip it! Alphanod! Oh, Josh is here. He's fine. Ah! I will say at the end of one, you're close to it. Wait, what? What, what? I will say at the end of one, you're so close to it. I was crying at 4 a.m. Aha! Be gone, but Oh, I love that just auto ban. Just can't even fucking do it. Oh, wait, wait. I gotta try it. I gotta try it. She. Wait, please work. Yeah, fuck off. Oh, that is now my favorite command. Oh. That just brought me so much joy. That's my favorite command now. Um, by the way, I need to update that. I was gonna, I was gonna put text on the overlay that says, uh, "Be gone, scrub." So I gotta do that. Oh, I gotta make notes of these things because I'll forget. Um, be gone, scrub, and uh, webcam skew? Question mark. Oh, I like that one. That was great. You love that? Oh, it's dude. Look, it, it did it all at once. It banned him. It did a text saying, say, back to the bridge, you troll, and let you know that it was banned. And then the fucking no scrub overlay. Brilliant. I love it. it makes me so happy. Also, Josh, I don't know what you're talking about. I will say at the end of 1.0, you're so close to it. I was crying at 4 a.m. end of 1.0 you're talking about 14 the end of 1.0 right is that what you're talking about and you're crying at 4 a.m what am i missing dude just wait it changes what it changes josh i'm confused oh yeah you told us that pancake that's a lot of mangas so the game is broken up into many parts okay One point oh the base game of fourteen. Two point oh is seventh straw. In between one point oh and Heaven Sword. Okay. Oh, were you just saying you were playing the game at the end of one point oh and you were playing at four AM and you start and you were crying? Oh, Alphanod changes name. Oh, it's all coming together now. That's what you're saying. It changes. It changes name, and it's the French version. Really? They just change it mid-game? <laughs> okay. That's interesting. And you, dear friend. By Ralga, you're a uh, fuck you, bot. All of you. I want more bots to come in. Or the people we can ban, just, just so that can happen. Also, obviously As mods, you can do the same I thing. I swear I heard talk of surrender, but I know that cannot be. It is not the Aorzean way. They change voice actors too. Wait, really? Wait, for Alphanod? Or you're saying like in general, like some other characters change voice actors? Because I could see that. It's no longer Sam Regal. Hey, my friends, accepting the Gallians' offer to vanquish the Primals would be folly. Folly, I say. Folly! For might is not the answer to the primal threat. Indeed, the more the Empire exerts... In general, state, gotcha. The worse matter yeah, I think I've already met someone that had a, a change in voice actor. And I think... It was like mid-dialogue expose. Like, they were they were talking a lot. And then there was a couple dialogue where it said they sounded like a different person. And it's because they switched the dialogue or something later. I think it was... um. Primals Lady with heavy hair. Mortals call upon them, and mortals are wont to appeal to a higher power when they are desperate. Nothing is more certain to breed desperation in the beast tribes than the Gallians' proposed solution. The true answer lies in a lasting peace, 
but the I hate my weapon. War and conquest. Should Eorzea fall into it looks so hands, dummy. There will be such it looks like a worse version of, like, the Breath of the Wild. I keep wanting to say Garlean, that, but that's this game. The, the Beastmen, the Centaur Bowl things. Looks like they're weapons. We are not blind to but with a stick attached. That each of your nations face. Yet you must not give Fuck, in. what are they called? It's driving me nuts. I remember five years ago when you wagered all for the sake of the realm. Remember what you fought for, what you were willing to die for. And he's going full chicken. Let the memories rekindle the fire in your heart. See that? Eorzea has need of it again. Come what may, we scions will never give up the fight. And so I bid you stand with us, and together we shall safeguard the future of the realm. Fuck, what are those things called in Breath of the Wild? It's gonna drive me nuts. Grasps not for the quick profit, but invests in the future. Wise words, eh, Raban? Sid, I... Your words stir and shame me in equal measure. How could I contemplate surrender? Does that phrase not sound like a kink phrase? Your words stir and shame me in equal measure? That 100% sounds like a kink phrase. Even the how could I contemplate surrender thing. That, that could be added to it. But that first bit, 100%. Someone back me up. full well that all we have, we owe to the sacrifices of those who went before us. Yet the seeming hopelessness of our plight robbed me of my insight. Oh shit. We Gridanians have no love for war. Yet we have still less for those who would threaten our homeland. Mr. Gray's words Ever made me stir and yet made me feel shame too. See, Josh gets it. We hold dear. And this shall never change. Gridania will go to war. That's the word. Gridania. We will fight the Empire for the sake of the realm and all who abide here. I did not like that. That was creepy as fuck. I got goosebumps. I did not like that. That was like murder child laughing. Laughter, like horror movie. <laughs> fuck you, Josh. See, you knew exactly what I was talking about. Imagine if a porcelain doll. Exactly. Exactly that. Don't ever do that again, Nanamo. <sighs> My heart. Not okay with that shit. Fuck off. Raubon, are we to be all done? No, no, Birch. Just like that. I lost one homeland. The thought of losing another had blunted my resolve. But no man knows better than I that if you want aught. You'd best be ready to die for it. With great danger comes the chance for great glory and great profit. We old dons who have turned sand into gold know this well. <gasps> Forbidden alchemy. It's like, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, the tenants say can't turn iron into gold. 
I've fair lost count. Not sand. Reckless, the lot of you, like bloody pirates. Well, I won't waste my breath trying to talk you around. That would be ignoring the law of equivalent exchange, because there's no metal in sand. For the most part. On account of being a pirate myself. <laughs> and the pirate who shrinks from a challenge is no pirate. Pirate Queen! At all. Those who would pick a quarrel with us must choose. Back down or go down with all hands. Let the Garleans come. The united strength of Limsa Lominsa. United we'll strength of America? Don't laugh again. In our realm is to be free of this pall of darkness. Let it be by our own hands. Oh, no! My dick pic! Damn it. We must needs consider how the weapon may be brought to bear against us. The maelstrom will secure strategic points along the coastline. In the meantime, the flames will destroy... This <laughs> is fucking how she walks! It looks like such a labored movement. Like, it looks like it takes a lot of effort to walk like 10 feet. Pray, leave the military matters to us and retire to the waking sands. We will send word anon. Did it. Oh, okay. We're going all the way over there. Uh. Oh, come on. Let me finish that. Also, heck, this gear. Can I just click one of these? Nope. It's fine. Uh, oh, shit. My inventory is getting full. was the one where is it there it is oh wait there it is Oh, that one's close too. Oh wait, I knew that. Never mind. Oof. I look rough. Ooh, cards. Shit. I have four of them. I must sell them. We go to. Aha. I need to put those in my inventory. Hello, friends. I am here. Excuse me. my relief to think that the alliance came so close to surrender but the fire in their hearts has been rekindled and they will fight to the last hold on a minute i don't like capturing my cursor in this game this warmth inside did you feel it too grandfather i would know something was that your power at work earlier Nothing of the sort. The leaders of Eorzea had lost their way. I merely helped them to find it again. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. 
Yes, our party returned. Wait, just there was a, a party. Ago. How close are you? It's all right, Sid. Your underwear is really high up. Oh, you guys can't see. We must needs plan our next move. Pray continue. We must needs. Your respective I don't know why, but that just sounds like. Sid. Would you be our man in Uldan? Have you guys seen Letterkenny? The episode where... I don't think you need to put S's on the ends of those words. That whole bit. Sushis and sashimis. That's what that sounds like. Must needs. I'll be whatever and where I've got so much time for sushis. We haven't a moment to sushis and sashimis. Right. Yes, you got it. Let's do this. Sankrid's fate weighs heavy on my mind. I cannot bear to think of him enthralled to an Oh, it's way better than salmon's. Mayhap you know this already. Bluefin tunas. But the Asians are immortal beings without physical form. Since time immemorial, they have fanned the flames of chaos from the shadows. In fact, K. Trevor Wilson is a friend of a friend. Really? Is that a uh, is that Wayne? That they might Wayne! have been seen. The Asians entrap and possess mortal men by means of malign artifacts known as crystals of darkness. One such crystal may yet be the key to saving Thancred. I don't want to save him. Fuck that guy. Squirrely Dan. I would love to be friends with real life Squirrely Dan. Where are you storing that? Created using data obtained from anomalous crystals found across Eorzea. It comes to us courtesy of the students of Baldessian, our distant allies. Even for an Archon, Thancred's talents are exceptional. We all had complete confidence in him. It was for this reason that none among us foresaw the danger in sending him to investigate the Asians alone. Betwixt her cheeks. Thancred had been striving to fill the void left by Louis Soir. Yet, it was plain that he was overtaxing himself. Yeah, he would volunteer for everything and work till he was- Oh, dead. it was that guy. Okay, I remember that bit. And the toll taken by his exertions made him vulnerable to Asian influence. The crystal that binds Thancred must be somewhere on his person. Betwixt. That, that's a, it, that's a fun word. Possessor would be compelled I like to that word. Betwixt. Over him. You have proven the stoutest of allies, standing with us through thick and thin. Call me stout. Yet the most perilous struggle is still to come. For the sake of the realm and Thancred. I ask that you lend us your strength once more. Thank you. <clears throat> from the bottom of my heart. <laughs> As I am sure you are aware, the realm was saved That's from me. certain doom. That's me. Ripping farts and breaking hearts. Known as the Warriors of Light. What you may not be aware of is that your many feats in service to the Scions have many feats, I only have two. Certain comparison. I must confess, you do remind me of them. Yet remember this, however glorious the past, it is the hero's lot to be judged on the deeds of the present. A new darkness threatens the realm, and the people cry out for a savior. I, I need a hero! You are she. And a man, a man, a man, a man, a man. You're in the present, guided by the crystal's will. Come, my friends, let us fight to safeguard the future of our beloved A. Oops, sorry. Oh my God, I have so many of those. Oh, more gear. I 
I need to go fight something. I can get my 1% spirit bond. Come on. All present? Then let us begin. We have received the details of the impending operation. And what promises to be the largest single counteroffensive in the realm's troubled history, the Alliance will strike at every Imperial stronghold standing upon Eorzean soil. Holy shit. As might be expected, the operation will be complex, but you need not commit its intricacies to memory. That was quick. Has he got rocket boosters on his shoes? It is enough that each man understands his part and plays it to the best of his ability. The finer instructions you will receive at each staging point. Uh, I don't know if she was talking more than that. Whoops. To begin, let us review the distribution of our forces. From west to east, the maelstrom of Limsa Lominsa, the immortal flames of Ulda, and the order of the Twin Adder of Gudania. Next, let us examine the locations of the Imperial Strongholds. Near Limsa Lominsa, we have Castrum Possidens, situated in eastern Valbrand, and Castrum Marinum, which lies to the south and east, in the midst of the Rotano Sea. Near Ulda, we have Castrum Meridium, Meridianum, to the north, and the coastal outpost of Cape Westwind, which connects Castrum Marinum to the mainland by means of Magitech Transporter. Near Gridania, we have Castramorians, which lies upon the eastern edge of the Twelveswood. And finally, in Mordana, stands Castrum Sentry, a thorn in the heart of Eorzea. The forthcoming operation will see Allied forces assaulted, assault each of the aforementioned locations with the ultimate objective of destroying the Empire's new weapon, housed with Castrum Meridanium. Meridanium. Meridanum. Meridani. Anianum. As one might expect of the Black Wolf's seat of power, Castrum Meridianum boasts all but the impenetrable, impenetrable defenses. If we are to breach it, we must needs isolate it from its sister strongholds. To do otherwise would be to risk being caught twixt hammer and anvil. The operation will comprise four distinct phases all told. The first shall see us eliminate one of the Black Wolves' most trusted lieutenants, Ritathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathathath
Meanwhile, the Order of Twin Adder will blockade the railway which connects Sentry and Meridian... Meridianum. Preventing the timely arrival of reinforcements for Mordana. A wise precaution! The monstrous locomotive which runs back and forth between the two castra is capacious enough to transport a small army by all accounts. It is well that Garleans did not think to give it wings. What's Marina? Marina? Fuck am I, I- The more I have to pronounce that word, the worse it gets. What's Marina? Marina? Don't tell Jim. Defenses have been comprised. The operation will enter its fourth and final phase. At least mine is a name. So it's harder to pronounce. It, it's make-believe. This will see the immortal flames enter the stronghold and suppress the remnants of the enemy garrison. Allowing Faith's unit to pass the un unopposed into the Praetorium, where they will locate and destroy Ultima Weapon. I don't know, that thing fucking just melts primals, so... By this feat shall the operation be deemed a success. Man, hold my arm there. Tired. In addition to the great camp grand companies, we can count upon the support of a variety of other parties, from the pirates of Limza Lominza to the Monteris of Old In all, the operation will involve no fewer than 12 major factions. All working together. Legend holds that the Archons were 12 in 1, and 1 in 12. It is for this reason that our grand endeavor has been dubbed Operation Archon. Countless free companies have also pledged their swords and more join us by the day. At long last, all of Eorzea is rising as one. As before, we scions shall work in concert with the grand companies. Ida, Papilemo, Ishtola, pray accompany your respective organizations on their missions. younger, I would have you represent us in Ulda. Be sure the financiers that they have made a sound investment. When that is done, pray return here and aid in the coordination of our forces. Tataru, please assist Ori Orianger in any way you are able, and ensure that everyone is kept abreast of the latest developments. It's like, ah, fuck, I hate this guy, but alright. Minfilia, Sid, and I accompany the main host in, adv in the advisory ca capacity. It will be our task to analyze intelligence as it comes into our possession and make the necessary recommendations to command. As Alphanon mentioned, you are to lead the elite unit adventurers, whose task it is to see each of Operation Archon's main objectives fulfilled. Yours is the most important role of all, and like to be the most dangerous. Pray choose your party well, and stint not in your preparation. The battle for the future of the realm is about to begin. Together, let us show the Black Wolf the power of United Eorzea. Clap! I'm assuming this is going to be like a dungeon. Pray report to the Immortal Flames encampment situated in the north of here when you are ready to be briefed on your mission. I cannot stress this enough, but please be careful. May you walk in the light of the crystal. Do you have any interest in Pathfinder, Kingmaker, or Wrath of the Righteous? No idea what that is. Pathfinder's, uh, tabletop, right? Or is that a, uh, an RPG? A video game version. Oh, are we ready to... Is this already going to be the thing, Birch? Also, I'm in Discord if you want to chat. If not, totally acceptable. Soon? Okay. Also, if anyone else wants to play, you're welcome to. Oh, Josh, now that you're here. So, I was talking with a, a couple people. Because, uh... Since we're now down a, a couple people for a while, uh, since Bibi being born, um, I was kind of just thinking about, like, just D&D &D in general. 
So I don't know if we're going to do like have the possibility of doing like a uh, one on ones or something or like maybe stuff that happened like in the past of characters or we can do some one shots um, or we can just like in terms of the one shots, we can just grab some other people that have wanted to try D&D or that have expressed interest in playing. So there's, there's a lot of just ideas mulling around. So and the fact that you're here on Sunday and you were saying that you might have Sundays free again. Um, so that might be a possibility if you were down. You're eating fun dip. They made some RPGs for PC and they they're done. I think maybe by the same people who did Infinity. Uh, I don't know. Okay, I am I am aware of the uh, that there's a video game form of them. You are welcome, Faith Gainsborough of the Scions. As communications officer, it fails to me to ensure your orders and provide guidance on forthcoming mission. Your first mission is to infiltrate the Imperial outpost at Cape Westwind and eliminate Perfectus Ritalin Sa Sas Arvina. All participating units are now in position and awaiting your arrival. Please proceed to the staging point and report to the Lieutenant Aldebert. This is but the first step in our bid to purge the realm of Garlean Menace. I shall pray for your success. I need to fucking level up these fucking gloves. That's all I need. Hey Josh, how does um spirit bond work? Does it have to be within a certain level or is it just kind of a certain number of experience gained? Oh fuck, that's a level 50. You're going to murder me. Lemons. I hate lemons. I despise lemons. I loathe lemons. Look at this ankle. It's swollen to the size of an ogre pumpkin. All because I slipped on that blasted lemon rind. And now here I am. Mere moments from my designation in Vesper Bay. Stuck on this side of the footfalls because of the lemon. You wouldn't happen to be heading in the direction now, would you? You could use a sturdy shoulder to lean upon. Okay. Oh shit, I'm going that way. It's fine. You don't see any more creatures? Really? Because... There's one right here. Why can't I attack this thing? How the fuck are just going? Do I have to pick him up occasionally? Because that'd be annoying. Boys. Well, we're about to have more people to fight. No oh, shit, fuck dick balls. Oh, I didn't stop that at all. It's fine. I need orange juice. I wasted all that orange juice, by the way. Just all that talking. Boys. Good job, Quetzalcoatl. Or a couple. Wait, what? Oh, I missed some chat. Hold on. Regardless, they're fucking amazing and it's based off old module. Water is the new one, which features a lesbian couple of lawful, good half elk pilot and, and a trans woman. <gasps> really? That's in the game? I am intrigued. Or a couple and it's so wholesome just using them. Really? All right. I'm interested. Fuck. My inventory is getting full. Hurry up, slowpoke. Damn. Still not done. Oh, I got some iron ore. Love that. Can you just fucking... What the hell? Can't you just ride my chocobo? That would make this so much easier.
Come on! Level up, stinking gloves. One of your companions lawful good gay POC. Oh, and they such a cinnamon roll when you flirt. He blushes so much. I love that. Who is a cleric? <laughs> that sounds cute. All right, I might have to add that to my wish list. Isn't Pathfinder D&D &D 3? It's not 3.5, right? Please tell me it's done. Yes! Finally. Extract. I really need to... S okay. I need to switch out some of these things. Alright, my helmet. Fucking... This can switch. I don't think I need that anymore. Uh, chest. Um... Oh wait, there's two. Which one's better? Whoa, look how cool I am! I look dope. How come I'm not wearing my offhand? That's weird. Nice gear. <gasps> Thanks! How are you? I'm tired, but good. Tired. Wait a minute. Does Warrior not have an offhand thing? Like a soul shard or whatever they are? Soul crystal? Interesting. Okay. I didn't know that. Why do only some of them get it? I look awesome. What was I doing? All right. I'll finish the other gloves soon. Check the pants. Oh, there's one. Fine. Uh, that one's close. Don't fight me. Giant ass motherfucker. Ah! Oh, he didn't come after me. He made attack noises and it scared me. Holy shit. Progress on a lot of these guys. Warriors have zero offhand. Interesting. I kind of figured everyone got a, uh, like a soul crystal or whatever those are called for their secondary, or what is it called? Their specialized, specialized job, something like that. Shit. This is stupid. <laughs> My inventory is getting full. I really wish they'd do like some sort of symbols in your inventory here to be like, hey, this one is part of a set. Pitter patter noise is gross. I could have swore I've done this already. I got a million things here. But things already hundred percent in. Oh Jada. 
That was a big grunt. I should probably repair before we do anything too. God, I got a million materia. I should probably outfit some of my armor and stuff now. Three, uh, Pathfinder's 2.5, but Twisted? Really? I thought it was three. It's so expensive. It literally took me like five hours to do a character. Oh my god. Man, but that was like a thing. Back in 3.5 days, like, it literally took you at least an hour to make, like, a level 1 character. There were so much. But it was also kind of fun. I really liked... The, both the, the good thing and the bad thing about 3.5 was the expansive set of rules. Like, the, uh, like, the rules for grappling are, like, a thousand characters. It's huge. It's a giant-ass paragraph. It's multiple paragraphs, actually. It's huge. It, but, like, the downside of some of the expansive rules in that game is, like, some of them were so large that you couldn't feasibly keep them all in your head. And so that caused people to not use a lot of the mechanics in the game because it was just such a pain in the ass to have to keep looking them up. So you just kind of were like... Screw it, I don't want to look it up, I'll do something different. So there's like a double-edged double, double -edged sword. Okay, I just extracted a million things. Can I? Oh, of course none of these have fucking... ...things in them. Wait, what? Wait, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Level 80, oh, okay, that's still useful, I guess. None of these have... Materia slots. Oh, that one does. Uh, how do I do it? Meld. Uh. Oh, my weapon has some materials too. Alright, let's do, uh. Battle dance materia. Here you go. Meld. Nice. Cool. Critical hit, tenacity. Ooh. 45 disciple of the hand. Oh, dicks. I am a 45 disciple of the hand. Or do I need to switch my... Maybe it's wanting me to switch... My class. Do I really not have a 45 Disciple of the Hand? Oh shit, I do not. Okay. Well, found something I gotta work on. 25 different starting classes, 161 subclasses, and 13 class evolutions you can change into mid-game. What? And then 10 more mythic specializations that are top of your class. Okay, I do remember hearing about mythic specializations. Operation Archon. I could fuck you guys up. Leave me alone. Don't fight me. Warriors have zero offense. Yeah, soul crystals are on the bottom right. Yeah. It, oops. This thing. I thought every class would have one of those.
So, your faith can't borrow. I feel as adventurer who led, who's lead to lead the assault. We've been expecting you. Our mails from friends report the Ritalin says Arvina departed Castrum, Ossid, and Zabelago. And sure enough, a convoy of Imperial airships landed here just now. The likelihood is high that our target was aboard one of the vessels. I've dispatched scouts to verify his presence before we strike. Is this the guy with the two shields? I want his shields. Command to all units, requesting status report. This is Antilan 1. Target has not been sighted. This is Antilan 2. Likewise, target has not been sighted. Antilan 3 here. We have got nothing for you neither. This is Antilan 4. Nothing to report as of... Wait, disregard previous message. Target sighted. I say again, target sighted. Understood. Hold your position. Oh wait, understood. Hold your position. I thought it was this guy. Look at this guy's hair. Attention all units, this is Lieutenant Aldebar Cotter. Why are you doing the Imperial salute? The first step of Operation Archon begins with us. Should we falter here, all hope of victory will be lost. It's no small burden, but now know that I believe in all of you. So believe in yourselves and together we'll blaze a path for our brothers and sisters of the Alliance to follow. Hell yeah, dude. Look at my awesome gear. We will create multiple diversions to disperse the enemy garrison. That should give you people a chance to breach their defense. Go now, Faith, and bring us Ritalin's head. May Roger grant you strength. Thanks, buddy. Did you see the pixels of his, his shield? Commence the di diversionary maneuvers. I kind of wish my tail came out of that little hole. You see that? Oh, it's not a hole. Never mind. It just looks like one from the back. Never mind. Where am I going? All the way over there. All right. What's up, bitch? Can I just... Yep, we can just walk on in. What's up, dudes? Just walking all in here. Can't stop me. Don't mind me. Bye! This is actually working? Later, bros. Peace out. Found it. All right. Now we'll, now, now we'll do some boxing. Oh shit, I don't like that. No, cut the cuddle, we gotta move from that, bro. It did. I win. You can do a search? That's awesome. Wait, what? Oh, there it goes. Hell yeah. Boss fight. All right. Just got to remember to turn on anger mode. Cape West Wind is the best duty. This one? Oh, yeah. I see right up there. Also taking these off. They're hurting my head. Bum, bum, bum. Yes, it's double shield, man. Is there anything I should know about this fight? Uh, it would appear we have unexpected guests. Now, where have I seen you before? Ah, oh, but of course, the woman who failed the mighty Titan. Is that the Icon Slayer? I see. A commotion without is not but a diversion. Allow me to hazard a guess. By eliminating me, you hope to undermine the garrison on Ossidens. Smart dude. A bold strategy, to be sure. But have you the strength to see it to fruition? 
Leave us. None of you are a match for her. Fuck yeah, he knows. Send word to the Castro Mossidents. Tell them that Lomins are coming. At, At once, my lord! We should stop them. Go fucking ham on him, no mechanics. Alrighty. Fifteen years have come and gone since Lord Van Belzar first set foot in Eorzea. Yet his ambition for the realm burns as strong as ever it did. Know what? Know you what fuels it, adventurer? The desire to deliver the people from their suffering. The lands he has conquered were all beset with problems, poverty, starvation, lawlessness, and strife. My homeland was no exception. Had my lord not reached out and claimed it for the empire, it would eventually have destroyed itself. But under the, his sad, sage leadership, my people enjoyed such peace and stability as we have never known. And he only desires the self-same for the people of this realm. Under his rule, Eorzea will be free from the shackles which bind it. The shackles of false faith. There would be no feeble leaders to misguide the masses, no icons to bleed them the realm dry. True peace would reign and the people would be free to live their lives without fear of persecution or oppression. Should you doubt the truth of my words, I bid you to look upon me. I am no son of Garlemald, yet Lord Van Belsar saw fit to raise me to a station of great honor. You measure a man but not by his birth, but by his worth. Such is the sense of justice. By the grace of his excellency, I am here I am where I was born to be, upon the field of battle. He has given me a noble cause to fight for, and worthy adv adversaries to, to smite. Let's fucking go. He's cool. I want your weapon and your suit of armor. I am not want to bear my steel needlessly, but if you are deaf to reason... In the name of Lord Von Balthar, Ritalin sends Avrina do swear to strike you down. I like him. I want to be his friend. Sorry for everyone that was waiting. Na -na 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 -na. So sorry. Me. Look at me, pretty. My thing didn't turn on. That's annoying. I clicked it. Oh yeah, he's just going mad, isn't he? He's ready match tech missiles? Alright. He's just gonna drop them on us? Oh yeah, we just messed him up. It's fine. I don't like that. Did I just die? Why can't I move? Nope. Holy shit. Be my friend. Give me your stuff. Uh, <laughs> Why are you? Not the Stargate. Forgive me. I have failed you. Lord Van Balsar. Balsar? Balsar? Oh, he's just taking a nap. Ooh. That's it? Holy shit. Okay. We did it. Okay. That light. The Magistic Transporter. Faith, are you there? What news of Fiddlin? Fallen? Yeah, we got him. With this deed, you have sown the seeds of the ultimate victory. Uh-oh, who showed up? The fading of the light presage... Presage is an end of the Empire's tyranny. Retail time sans Arvina is no more. Let the next phase of Operation Archon commence. Well. We should, uh... I need to, I need to get moving. Tis I. It seems you have done it again, Faith. I'd raise a tanker to you, but I'm afraid we've got no time to savor the victory. 
There's still the small matter of infiltrating cash from Meridanum and destroying the ultimate weapon. I know, I know. No rest for the return. preternaturally gifted. Now stop feeling sorry for yourself and make your way back to the Immortal Flames encampment. The communications officer will issue you your orders. I'll be waiting for you with this main host. Damn, I look cool. Oh. Hey, dude. You angie? Look, Hadelin. Your minion comes, bringing the light. Alas, the gate to the void already stands open. Soon darkness shall consume all, and you shall bow down before the one true god. Perfectus? Slain? We got a bliss all, my lord. And at the end of the yeah. icon slayer. If the centurion who survived the attack is to be believed. <gasps> Moira, how's it going, friend? Oh, welcome to the stream. Ritalin. I'm calling him Ritalin. I don't care. Where were his men when he faced the enemy? Fleeing even as their commander yielded up to his last breath. If it should prove my question, they question his right. Uh, I cannot speak for them, my lord. Make a pardon, my lord. But there is more. The mi Whoops, misclick. Likewise, the Crimson Fleet moves to blockade Castrum Marinum. Say no more. So, this is their answer. Very well. We shall crush them as they crush the icon- as we crush the icons. Go forth and show them the futility of their resistance. I like his helmet. Yes, my lord. Meant to sleep for like an hour and a half and slept through an alarm for over three hours. Oof! Good nap, though. Sounds like he needed it. Ah, oh, sick. I look awesome on my motorcycle with this gear. How come this doesn't have any things? Fine. Just demount me then. Forgot to do my inventories. Oh, that's what you meant by the bottom right. My bad. I'm a doomy. Hello, friend. On to the next mission. Signed, Gainsborough. Your deeds of this day are an inspiration to us all. With the death of the Prefectus, our... Operation Archon has entered its second phase. Even as we speak, the Maelstrom moves to blockade Castrum Ossidens in Castrum Marinum. And as far, and far to the east in the Black Shroud, the Order of the Twin Adder advances upon Castramarians. Already you have done much to advance our cause, performing such feats as, as are worthy of song. But if our plans is to succeed, more is required of you. Let me know when your preparations are in order and I shall relay you to the particulars on your next mission. These are all garbage. Give me your money. Oh, give me new gear, or a new weapon. Phase 2 of the operation is presently in motion. Our brothers and sisters of the Maelstrom are holding their own against Garlean forces upon Valbrand and the Rotano Sea. Ere long, the third phase will begin and you must take to the field at once more. 
The immortal flames shall strike at Castrum Meridanum by the way of diversionary maneuver. While the Garlands and thus locked in battle, you are to infiltrate the stronghold and bring down the magic field that surrounds the Praetorium. The staging point for the mission lies in the shadow of Castrum Merid Meridianum in northern Thalanon, and that is where you must go. On your way there, however, I would ask that you make a brief stop at Camp Blue Fog, one of our key outposts in the area. The garrison, I am told, is in low spirits, and it would do our troops well to see the hero of Cape Westwind appear before them. For the good of our cause, please stoke the fire in their hearts. Okay. Sure can do. No! I'm not attuned to it. Dicks. No! I'm not attuned to any of it. I can go there, though. We have arrived in more donut. Fat cat! Wait a minute, why did I fucking go there? Where the hell am I? Oh, oh, that's golden saucer. Why did I go up there? I'm, I'm dumb. It's fine. Just wasted money. And missed out on Fat Cat. No, I was still... Oh, I didn't think it would keep me mounted. Wait, wait. You need to go north, right? Yep. Motorcycle. Look at all these baby levels. Do, 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 do. Uh, can I help someone? Someone in need of helpings? Oh, you're fine. Level 54, damn. Touch the crystal. Go talk to the chocobo person. Oh. What's up, dude? Is it cracked? What? Cracked fist. Guardians Barrow, yours is most welcome presence here at Camp Blue Fog. Logically, logistically speaking, we're ready to march on Castrum Meridanum at moment's notice. At last, while our troops are here in body, their minds are anywhere but. The garrison's mood is dark, so daunting is this prospect of joining that may prove to be the bloodiest battle in history. But with a hero such as you walking among them, we may yet rekindle the dwindling embers within their souls. Go talk to them. Yes, I want that. Oh shit. I am full! You need to sell some shit. New weapon? Ah, oh, new weapon. Oh. Fuck, I really need to sell some shit. What the hell is this? Earrings. Alright. Sergeant Gainsborough, I mentioned that I was hoping you might raise the flagging spirits of men and women of our garrison. Why not? It's no unnecessary labor or laborious task that we ask of you. The mere presence of a hero such as you walking in their midst would no doubt serve to restore them in a measure of morale. And so I ask you this, make your way to the Cerulean processing plant and report to General Raban once you have arrived. 
And Godspeed, Sergeant Gort Gatesboro. Our troops are counting on you. All right, I can do that. Let's set their hearts on fire. Whoa! Did you see that? Big balloon thing. Where'd you go? Oh, you demounted. That was wild. Can you do it again? Oh, eyeball. Oh, <gasps> a fate. Why, yes, I will join. I help. Oh, wait, <laughs> that's not a person. I thought that was a person for a second. That's a lot of boys over there. Damn. Oops. No, don't do that. I did it! Okay. Oh, another one. Bad boy! Chonky boy! Leave me alone. Oh, there's a minute of that? There's no way I can get that done. Fuck that. I love his jump wiggle. Touch the crystal. Any chocobo? There you are. Looks like it looks cool when I'm all glowy like that. Nope. Whoops. Whoa, that was weird. A bomb! Oh, it's you. <gasps> well, if it isn't the hero who brought down the Perfectus, it's good to have you with us, friend. As you can see, the mood about the camp here is grim at best. I was hoping that your presence alone might serve to raise spirits some. Unfortunately, it would seem that many are too preoccupied wallowing in fear and self-pity that they have yet to even notice that you have arrived. Might I ask you to just make the rounds and share a few words of encouragement to those men and women whose spirit falters? I had a mind to do it myself, but I am quite certain I would carry more weight coming from you. Once you have seen the, to the others, go and do the same for Edelstein. No matter what he may claim, the lieutenant would also be better for a bit of rousing. Trust me. I know. Let's go, go rouse some friends. Oh, it was right next to one. Hey, dude. Uh, psych them up. Let's do it. Ah, break my fist. I break my fast on garlicans, and right now I'm very hungry. What? Okay. It's you. Well, demount me, dang. Ooh, the garlicans are not fierce fighting as you. I'd soon face Vanguard while naked as my name day. Oh, his birthday? Is that what that's called? Name day? Chonky boy! I'm Waddle. Hello. Wake up! 
Your strength gesticulation has awakened me to my purpose. Hero or no, I will fight tooth and nail to protect the realm. Good on you, mate. You would stoke my fighting spirit as you did our recruits? Aha! A kind of, but hardly necessary. I assure you, the fire in my heart rages as strongly as it ever has. I'm sure. Oh. Here. Psych you up. Let's go! I Ralgar, without my realizing it, the fire of my resolve has grown dim. It had grown dim, but thanks to you, it burns red hot once more. It, if needs be, I shall lay down my life to secure victory for Eorzea. Sick. These are all about the same. They're all the same. Wait. Strength, vitality, determination, tenacity. Nope. They're all the same except for that last one. Sick. New earrings for me. Or not. Really? Oh, that's right, because I have this thing on. And that thing just keeps love. Holy shit, that's way better. Yep. I should have just taken the money. It's fine. Should have taken the money and run. Vertically challenged. At more? Wait. You're going to give us another pair of earrings after giving us earrings? If we're going to the flames of courage that burn within our brave men and women's hearts. And for this, I thank you. And now the time for battle is nigh. We must march forth with no worries or regrets. General Bond awaits you at Castrum Meridanum. The battle will not be an easy one, but I trust you are up to the task. Godspeed, Sergeant Gainsborough. Be on it. That's, uh... Okay, it's not that bad of a run. This thing stays, huh? The, the rage? I thought it kicked down pretty quick. It's kind of cool that it stays around. gonna walk right through these guys again later bros you see nothing ouch okay you might see something what's up dudes goodbye roam from the trenches i hear it i hear returns i trust that your visit has done much to lift the spirits of our garrison on the eve of the greatest battle Time is of the essence. Let us com commence the briefing at once. The thing scared the shit out of me. I thought it was going to come murder me. Hype words, here they come. Friends! Oh, she looks cool, the girl behind me. Holy crap, that guy's tall. Or maybe they're, they're... Okay, they're just behind him. Brothers and sisters! Of the Alliance! I shall share with you glad tidings. Doubtless spurred on by news of the Siege of Castamorians, the Maelstrom has struck a double blow. Castamorians and Castamarinum are now under blockade. Phase two of Operation Archon is a success. Reports tell us that the Garleans offered fierce resistance, but that the Admiral yielded them not, not one ilm. With Ossidens, Marinum, and Orions thus suppressed, the third phase may begin in earnest. Even as we speak, the order of the Twin Adder moves to block it, block the railway leading hither from Castrum Sentry. And that can mean but one thing. The hour has come to strike at the heart of the Garlean invasion force. Castrum Meridanum, the den of the Black Wolf. My fellow Eorzeans, I am in Philia Mish- Whoa, come on. 
I am Infilium, mistress of the science of the seventh dawn. There exist myriad barriers that divide us. Those of race and nation, language and creed to name but a few. Such barriers serve to isolate us from our neighbors, yet they also serve to define who we are. Shorn of them, there would be little to distinguish one from another. And the rich variety of our lives would give way to sterile orthodoxy. These barriers can never truly be broken down, of course. Not so long as there is liberty in the world, but they can be transcended. Verily, we will do so now in coming together for the grand endeavor to fight side by side in defense of our shared home. Before me stands the- Oh, I should- Hmm, gotta fix something here. Hold on. Before me stands an adventurer, Faith Gainsborough. You all know her as the woman who will lead the unit tasked with destroying the Ultima weapon. We Scions know a different Faith, however. We know her as a dear friend who has endured untold hardship on her behalf. A true hero who has never- who has ever blazed the path for us to follow. And why do I tell you this? I tell you, friends, because it is time for us to blaze the path for her. Our objective is to wreak such havoc outside the walls of Meridonium as to afford Faith and her comrades the time they need to disable the Mag Magitech field generator within. With the path thus cleared, we may finally turn our minds to the true goal of this operation. The destruction of the Ultima Weapon. All troops, prepare for battle! What's up, Caitlin? Welcome to the stream! How you doing, friendo? Oh, hey, Sid. I fear I can't, I can't accompany you this time. The unenviable task of facilitating, facilitating communications between our forces has been entrusted to the Ironworks, you see. Know, though, that I'll be praying for your safe return. High five. See that you come back, my friend. May the crystal bless you and keep you and keep you. We will suffer the black wolf to prowl our lands no more. Let us teach the hunter what it is to be hunted. Forward, comrades! For yours, yo! Yay! She looks like Minfilia, or, uh, Ishtola. Go now, Faith. Bring us one step closer to the dawn. You got it. We go fuck up some boys. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, speaking of duty finders, I should probably go to the the other things I don't remember this or that oh yeah I do okay join item level however is not the only value you need to keep your eye on almost all important any level of your class job is the level of your gear attributes Okay. There needs to be whoa, two tanks, two healers, and four DPS. Interesting. Was that like that last time? Try and end. What's up, my dude? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, you missed. You missed it. It wasn't too bad though. We just kind of raffle stomped it. Oh. That was my bad. You can drop me from the party. I have to do stuff for yeah. food. I, I just saw that you weren't here. It's fine. It's fine. Sorry. You're good. Maybe I can go beat up some things.
You wanna fight? Let thing fuck me up. Never mind. I'm still queued for Westwind. No, cash from Meridium. Westwind, the hardest trial. That's the one I already did. That one, we just we just smushed him. Oh, I was queued for both. Oops. Ooh, big purple barrier. Wave. Anger time. All right, I don't know what I'm doing, so. Hey, two, two warriors, let's go. Oh shit, just pulling everything. Oh! Okay. Hope you like everyone running, rushing past you. Yeah. I was just gonna say. These people obviously know what they're doing. I do not. Are those gonna bombard us with big bombs? I got one dude. <laughs> Whoa, why did... Where'd the sound go? Hello? Absolutely no sound. I'm gonna die. Thank you. Where's the sound? Is that a bug? Is that a known bug? Oh my god. Another cutscene. The sound is gone. Um. This is weird. Hey, buddy. That one guy's just been following me this whole time. Got him. Wow, these people don't give a shit. Boom. Okay. Well, that happened. Oops. Come on, sound. What the fuck? Yeah, I had to restart the game to fix it. That's cool. All right, well, after this, we'll have to restart. That's annoying. That means I'm gonna have to go back in queue, although it's not long. If I didn't know better, I'd swear you had a personal grudge against Magic Armor. Hey, dude. I thought you weren't gonna join me. What can I say? I couldn't bear to let you have all the fun. Hell yeah. Don't worry, Biggs and Wedges have everything in hand. Truth be told, I think they like they like having the work on of three men. Wedge wasn't exactly pleased to be left behind, though, and made quite sure I knew it. I must say, our recent struggles have done wonders for the lad's spirit. This is weird. Given the size of this place, I suspected there might be an armor or three to get, be had, and here we are. I hope there's not cool music that I'm missing out on. Hmm. Not as bad as I thought. If I have half Marquez's talent for mending things, I should be able to get it working again. Listen, Faith. We intercept an Imperial communication indicating that the ultimate weapon is indeed being housed within the Praetorium. We've also learned that the field which protects the compound is powered by no fewer than three generator towers. If you're to de de deactivate the field, you need to locate and disable them all. And I'm here to help you do just that. See that chute? It leads to the waste disposal. Somewhere nearby, there will be a cerulean 
facility supplying fuel to the close closest of the three towers. Find the place and break things. Break stuff. Go on ahead, Faith. I'll be along as soon as I finish my repairs. Now you've heard all the music before. It's just this cash for music you've heard already. Okay. I just made twenty six thousand. Examine. Let me in. There he goes. Please reload the music. Fuck. This is this is awkward. I don't like it. I don't like the quiet. What if I... I wonder if I can turn it off and on again. I highly doubt that'll work, but I'm gonna try. System. Bummer. Whoa, look at that bow. Very glowy. Alistair. Ultimation. Zero fire. I'm slow. Searchlight darkens. Yeet. Target that guy. Fucking this one. Yeet. All right, I'm going to catch up on friends. Oh, boys. Make sure to grab them. Here we go. Ruffle stomp time. Boom. I'm stunned. I love it. My God, we're just wasting these things. That's the downside of coming into a game after, like, everything's been nerfed. You can just fucking... Wolf stomp that shit. Oh, no sound. I hate it. Unstable paneling. We gotta click this? Oh, he's doing it. Okay. Here we go. Cutscene. Can't find any definitive answer to the problem, though I know restarting the game worked for me. Which, Q, yay. I mean, the Q wasn't too bad. It was only, like, less than a minute today. But I don't know how bad it is now, because it's late. Or it's later in the evening when people are starting to pop on. I think I've had this problem before, too. Oh, hey, buddy. Where is he? Uh, excuse me. Where's one of the, uh, the card people? Big Baum. Fuck, we're going to get sealed off because we're not there. What an asshole. You can't run him slow. Oh, made it. Ah, I took aggro. They like them apples. Friend or foe? Hey, friend. Really? That thing just took it out? Damn. There you are. I didn't have the patience to take the long way around. I see you disabled the first generator. That leaves us with two. Ah, bugger. That was me, wasn't it? Well, there's nothing for it if... But to press on, we must see to the remaining generators before the enemy has a chance to regroup. Did an alarm go off or something? Because I can't hear it. You go on ahead, Faith. 
I'll bring up the rear. Okay. Only about 300 Q for me at this time of day. Not bad at all. Yeah, that's only like a minute or two. Let's raise some hill. Of course I had to do it like right when I got an instance too. So I have to fucking sit here and do this all quietly. No idea what's happening. Although we can hear mamas show up as mamas. Whoa. Eurasian prognosis. Oh, we just running. All right. Of course we are. That's what we do. Dude, I cannot take aggro from these guys. This is crazy. Okay, I lied. I totally did. I'm gonna die, though. Sweet. Awesome heals. <laughs> Play some back some chip tune. Oh, I totally should. Actually, I might be able. To, I might actually have background music. Hold on. I do. There you go. There it goes. Holy crap. Very loud, though. Now the tank is probably super overgeared. Probably, yeah. People just get melted, too. That way? All right. It let me know the sh straight shot was ready. That's weird that it's telling me other people abilities get ready. We can dance. What the hell's happening? Should I be helping somewhere else? Did we not pick up the keys or something? Oh, are we just waiting for people? Come here, Sid. Oh yeah, we were just waiting for him. That was weird because he disappeared up by that gate. Oh shit, hello. Oh, that's one of the Reapers. Isn't that the, the new set? Or the one of the new classes? Come on, Sid. Battle voice. Oh, fuck. Did that thing pop? Yes. like you guys. Fuck you. Fuck you guys. No buffing the dude. Uh-uh. 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 What are you doing? Not allowed. Stop buffing. That's a medic. Fuck you. You're being obnoxious again.
Big man. I got this guy, don't worry. Did it. Oh, yes, wait for City Slow. He laps too. Yeah. Just kind of disappeared for a minute. Fine work, Faith. Stand clear. I have a mind to lose some fireworks. Go for it. Diverting all power to cannons. Why didn't you do that earlier when you needed to destroy shit? I'll make my own sound effects. Yes. Oh, it's... the machine is sleepy now. Damn it. There goes the core. I fear may have overestimated its maximum operating capacity. A few orders of magnitude. I blame Marquez. <clears throat> we'll need to find another way to bring down the third generator. Oh shit. She has her own mount. Well, well. The traitor himself. I didn't even get a chance to finish reading that. You're going ahead, Faith. I need to get to the bottom of something. Okay. Peace out, bro. Oh, this way? Okay. Look, we're all glowing. Team Glowy. Attacking friends, so whoa, that's a big dude. Someone's doing a shit ton of damage. Ah, okay, I almost attacked them. Oh, someone pulled them, so... Bonk! Stuck. 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 Protect the friends! Who's making the giant... Orb? I was right. We were going to get bombarded. Ring, ring, ring. It's me. Are you all right? That's an assault craft you're going up against. You don't stand a chance with conventional weapons. Well, bring the fucking Enterprise. You're going to need something big to bring it down. A mortar, a cannon, anything. Hold on, Faith. I'm on my way. Ah, just shake it off. Not scared. Hey, look, I found a cannon. And it's lined up directly at it. I'm assuming we take care of that guy. Yep. Fuck! Man, so many cutscenes just fuck everything up. Wow, we just ruined them. I'm assuming when this first came out, that, that took a lot longer than that. Fools! 
If you are resolved to die here, you might as least have done so without first making a mess of the place. Come back here. Oh, she wants the box. I see the Garland is not with you. What was the pity? I had hoped to slay him myself, but never mind the traitor for now. I so look forward to meet this meeting, Faith Gensboro. <gasps> you know my name. Yes, I know much, much and more about you, about your strength and your hidden talents. I would sample them firsthand, and you will indulge me. Now kiss? Gear level's absurd right now? Yeah. That's one of the downsides of older MMOs. What? What the fuck are you spawning in? I just get knocked back with an asshole. Why are we going that way now? He's targeting me, but he's going to move. Yeah. Okay. What the fuck? That was weird. Hey, achievement unlocked. Love that. Sup, bitch? Let's go. All right, I might die here because I don't know how this works, so. Stop that. Almost blowing up my friend. Probably shouldn't have used that, but it's fine. You should kick that. Or not. Oh, she's a reaper. I thought she was a uh, warrior. Kick. Didn't work. Oh, I can't. He's untankable right now, huh? You're gonna get smacked. Boom. You're gonna get smacked. Boom. We do it. Now we get a fighter for reals this time, right? My lord was not was quite taken with you and the powers you possess. The echo naturally could not help but wonder whom this princess among women might be. Only you discover that you are but another adventurer, no better than the multitude. Yet in spite of this, the masses hold you with their champion and shower honors upon your head. It defies all reason. You're just jealous. How is it that you could be such a thorn in our side? Whenever you appear, you leave havoc in your wake. Even slew Ritalin, one of the very finest. Well, I will not speculate. Truth be told, I couldn't care less how you have done these things. What matters to me is the fact that you have done them. If you are allowed to continue, it will eventually deprive me of all that I have toyed for. All that is mine by right. My minions, my comrades, even my Lord Gaius. Well, you cannot have him. I was right. They are dating. His dreams, ambitions, his body and soul, they are mine! Do you hear me? All mine! Okay, possessive much? I lost everything once before. I will not suffer them. Something, I missed it. Come at me, bitch! I will kill you, adventurer. Only your death can bring me peace. Okay. I know the gimmicky gimmick of this bit. She's 100% jealous. Livia is super possessed. Oh, absolutely. Wait, did we win already? While I was in the cutscene? No. Come here. Let's box. Ooh, boys. Boys, the smash. 
We spin to win. More. Spin to win. That's a big man. Uh, 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 uh. No attacking friends. You attack me. We win. The gimmick gimmick is that her tank suit has to be damaged by the mortars. Oh, yeah. I figured that. Oh, it's happening again. All over again. Please. I cannot bear it. Don't take him from me. You're dying. I don't think you have a thing to say here. My lord. Yes. Time to take a dirt nap. So long with no sound. Another poor fool who craved Gaius' affection over all else. May her soul no rest. Tis a miracle no harm has come to you, my friend. One for which I will happily give thanks. And the wonders do not end there. Truthfully now, did you really mean to send that assault craft crashing into the generator tower? If you did, you're a bloody liar. If you didn't, well, you're too modest. <laughs> Whichever you are, you've managed to open the way for the Praetorium. The only problem is, we can't reach it on foot. Nay, we'll need to take the Enterprise. I left at the Cerulean Processing Plant, so let's regroup there. This is it, Faith! The final confrontation awaits. Is this the end of the game? BGG. Elegant tombstones. Elegant tombstones. Relics of the lost, long lost civilizations. Paris, several ages past. It is said that they certain. Contain the knowledge of the Elegant Empire and as such are highly sought by collectors. Rowena and her associates are representatives of such a collector and have been sent to Revenant's Toll in the heart of Mordona. I are employed to seek out adventurers willing to exchange the tombstones they come across for journey or weapons and armor. Oh. I think I understand those. There are no party members. Really? Oh, exit. I was going to say, if there's no exit, no gear or anything, huh? Welcome to gear tokens. I was going to say that's sounds similar to other MMOs. What's up, Robin? I knew you wouldn't let us down, soldier. But the Praetorium stripped of its defenses, the way to ultimate weapon lies open. The time has come for the final phase of Operation Archon. All right. Well, none of these are as good as mine, so we'll just take the money. All right, we're going to log out. It's Badger of Heroes in another game. Yeah. Yes, I'm pushing okay. Come on. That's annoying. I can't just say okay. I'm guessing a log out isn't going to work. I'm, I'm going to have to do a full on reboot. Yeah, I don't hear anything there. Whoops. Damn it. That's obnoxious. Perfect timing. Turn off music. All right. Please work. Authenticator. There it is. I was going to say, I hear no sound, and there it goes. We have sound! You can only auto-log out in sync trace. I thought it, you could do it anywhere. You're just like, yeah, I'm done. Let me out. Yo! Immediate! Nope. This is the end of the, the original game, right? Vanilla? Turn that down so you don't hear me crying. Crap, I gotta pee. All 
Actually, wait. I'm gonna pee real quick. Because I have to go really bad. Please, I'll be back in like 30 seconds, but we haven't done this in a while, so enjoy BRB screen! Comfortable. These rocks are like impossible, dude. <gasps> no. No. No, 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 no! Crappy game. Oh, I was so far. <sighs> I'm dead inside. I'm All right, I'm back. Oh, I feel so much better. All right, he wants to talk. He's going to give me. Fantasia. Single opportunity. Oh, that's the edit the appearance thing. The rooster was telling me about that you get at the end of the game. For the final phase of the operation, my flames will storm Castrum Meridianum. Meridianum. And suppress what is left of the Imperial Garrison. If all goes well, this will allow you to reach the Praetorium unopposed. Fit and ready for your encounter with the Ultima weapon. Yours is the most dangerous mission of all, but the best must bear their heaviest burden. And you're the best we have. There's no, not another soul in this realm that can see this deed, done, deed done. And well, Meryl Wib and Can, Can E are the same mind as me. I swear I can read. Um, I'm assuming we're going to be fighting the dragon guy too. It all hangs on your success. You must not let our plight make you desperate. Victory belongs to the bold, not the reckless. Ours are wont to sing of heroes who value their life at naught next to honor, love, and liberty. But I tell you now, that which men value at naught, they sell cheap. Rest no more than you must, you hear me? Now, best you were off. We have work to do, the both of us. See that your preparations are in order, and then report to Sid. He awaits you with the Enterprise at the Cerulean Processing Plant. May Valor grant you strength. Okie dokie chokey. Down there? All right. I could teleport. We'll run. Oh, wait. There's a fate here. Oh, 47 seconds left. Nope. I need to level up my uh, profession so I can apply better, uh, whatever's. You know what I mean? Materials. Actually, how much long does this have? It doesn't tell me. That's weird. Oh, it's because it's something I probably... Sure, let's do it after I drink some juice. I should probably eat these other things that are low. Come on. 
There we go. Hello? There you go. Like a knight in shining armor, from a long time ago, you have ridden forth from the blue mist on your gallant steed. Come to help a poor man crippled by his inane ability to help himself. Oh, I apologize. My colleagues tell me I have a tendency to wax dram dramatur dramaturgical when it comes to asking someone for their aid. No idea what that word is. I am but a humble droughtsman, toiling in this terrible place to hammer out a meager existence for me and my wretched wife. Oh, there I go again. All right, here's the rub. We have the processing plant require earth cores to maintain the stability of the raw cerulean piped in from the mines. As we are but mere engineers, we must look to adventures to attain those cores. So what do you say? 49? Sure. Huzzah! You have my undying things, friend. Sure. Look at all these things. Oh, I just need the cores, I think. Shit. Come here. You guys are annoying. Yep, I just need cores. I didn't need to fight these guys at all. Oh, wait, yes I did. They give me cores. Hell yeah. Thank you, Chocobo. deliver them Just to you have you finding cores yet you're seven ah let's fade the bottles together towards the core to strengthen our bonds just more the cores to further strength our bonds all right get it there's quite a few on the ground so that was about a third so probably 14 more Shadow freaked me out for a second. You gonna join me? No? Fight me, big thing. Whoa. Whoa, look at that thing. He's cool. Oh, that person's going to fight him. I should go over there. No, he's not going to go fight him. Go get him, quite the coddle. I need you to take aggro, bro. Are you serious? Oh, 
I'm gonna go fight that big thing. Although, it's massive and it'll probably fuck me up. I gotta know. I got you four... Oh, perfect. Hell yeah. Must be returning... Wait, what? Did I fuck something up? Deliver the course to the droughtsman. I did. I only have 40 seconds now. Action cancelled. You are under attack. Fucking... Wait a minute. I should be done. Should I not? Holy shit, that's the biggest damage I've ever done. Oh my god. So much damage. Three more. What the fuck? I'll gather my things, rid of myself with a short but sweet journey back. Oh, okay. I just had to wait. All right. That was weird. There's just some bonus cores, I guess. Look at this boy. Anyone know how to mark things? Oh. Shit. I want to help. No! I didn't get here in time. Son of a bitch. Oh, this guy's gonna fuck me up, isn't he? Oh yeah, I do very little damage. This takes forever. Alright, fuck this. I'm out. I couldn't demount fast enough to hit the that bomb to be part of that fate, even though it came, probably would give me nothing. I'd literally do crap damage before he died. Sid, what's up, my dude? The Enterprise is at your disposal. When you're ready to head for the Praetorium, you only say a word. If we succeed in destroying the ultimate weapon, it will deal a crippling blow to the Empire's hopes of conquest. After that, the 14th Legion would not dare to move against us, barring the discovery of further Allegan Doomsday devices, that is. Let's be on our way, Faith! Gaius and his plaything await. Oh yeah. Wow, so many dungeons right in a row. Oh shit, I should check my, um... My monies. Hey, my reputation. Nice. It's control C. Aha. Okay, I'm still, I'm fine. We got both our tanks, no heals or no DPS. Wow, that thing's leveling up quick. I guess we'll go fight some things, see if we can get it finished. Merchant Mender, actually. Let's get rid of some stuff. Uh, nope. You want some of my money sort? Where's my monies? Snow White die, the one that goes for a lot of money. Didn't I pick up money bags? There they are. So. Also, where are those cards? Oh, I can't sell them. False.
What's my Chocobo's saddlebag looking like? Pretty dang full. gonna move some stuff over real quick so I can have a little bit of inventory space there we go commence there's no money there's only fan fantasy final <laughs> you can sell cards at at a place oh can you shit I think I've just been dropping them We at the prote or Praetorium. I, man, I'm struggling with words today. Lots of people talking. <laughs> Hope you like cutscenes and dungeons. Oh man, the last one was that guy is very shiny. So here we are. The Ultima weapon will almost certainly be housed in the depths of the complex. This is it, my friend. Look at the little short person back there. The, the with the the robe. Can't even see through their face. It's creepy. This is my first time here. Oh, the long one. Same first time. Wave. I don't know what I'm doing. The heart of the party. Nice. Not exactly sure what I'm doing, so I'm just taking aggro. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Someone gonna heal me? Someone gonna heal me? Nice. Off to a great start. I couldn't even get in the terminal. Well, that was cool. Got it. Click that terminal. You run past everything. Yeah, I didn't even see it. Well, you may be unable to re-enter ongoing battles. Well, this is cool. That person lived. Holy shit. Because that person's stuck on me, my dead body. Oh, I can just release. Okay. Well, this person's just stuck. I'm not gonna be able to get through here, am I? Oh, it's immediate. It's not like a inter interact thing. Okay, that makes a little more sense. Okay. Left. Left. Is this person being friendly? Tell me where I gotta go. I'm guessing it's this way. No, they're as lost as I am. Heard attack. Whoa! Hello. Go down here. Hopefully they go into one of those like rooms where we have to teleport. That'd make things a lot easier. Oh, dicks. Aha! Okay. I didn't have to activate anything. I just run into it. 
Gaius! Ah, uh, Sid, my boy, you are late. There's something I always meant to tell you, yet the time never seemed right. It concerns your father. Is he gonna pull a Vader? What of him? In the winter of his years, Midas came to the Abor's part in Meteor. He told me he wanted nothing more than to wash his hands of the whole sordid business. But he did not wash his hands of it. He helmed the project until the day it killed him. Come now, Sid. You must know that he did not have the luxury of choice. By the time he realized his error, it was too late. Meteor had him completely in his thrall. Shortly before his transformation, mayhap sensing that something was amiss, your father confided in me all the regrets of his life. Most of them concerned you. Wow, what a dick. Early on in your career, you realized that you, while you were, had a talent for devising armaments, it would never fulfill you. Long before you knew your own mind, he saw that you would be far happier using knowledge for peaceful purposes, and the thought touched him. He was a changed man for it, though he could not let it show. You blew holes in this place just so you could say this to me? What is it that you want, Gaius? I want you at my side, Sid. Take up your father's mantle and become the Empire's lead engineer. It is your destiny. My father had a change of heart. You said so yourself. Besides, I have a long known my Disney, I assure you. It lies not with the Empire. A pity. And what of your adventurer? Will you not consider making common cause with me? With your powers joined to mine, we might do much for all this realm. Together we could bring order to Eorzea and usher in a lasting peace. Heck you. No, and I can expect no better answer than this. So be it. It was your strength that made me proffer my hand in friendship, and it is your strength that makes me proffer now my blade. S save as an ally, you are too dangerous to be let to remain. Oh! Hey, buddy. That's the thing at the end of 7. That you're, like, fighting on the platforms going to Genova. Run, Sid. Or stay. It makes no matter. You cannot something guys wait damn it likely there'll like be a cutscene soon you can warp to boss room but <laughs> made it just in time ah oh shit i'm gonna die that's annoying that's funny it was just perfect timing of events that i walked through it that it caused it well, it's fine. Yes. Oh, shit. Spawning right on explodey bits. Why can't I attack him? There it goes. Gaius, he's headed to the ultimate weapon. If we find him, so, so too we will find our quarry. With these instruments, we can monitor every nook and cranny in the cash room. I think it's time we divide our forces. Pray go on and give chase. I'll track your movements from here and guide you through the complex. Is it going to actually split the party? We'll stay in contact via Link Pearl. Be careful, all right? Oh shit, my bad. I'm sorry. I thought it was gonna be a teleport.
don't like I take that aggro because uh Fuck. Oh, I don't have the thing I need. Come on, where are the fucking heals, bro? It's like we don't have a healer. We have two healers. They're literally just letting us die so they can just res us. That's annoying. Fuck that. I'm turning off anger stance then. Fuck that. I'm just going DPS. They're just going to let me die and not even bother to heal. Monster, I should apologize. What did I do? Oh, with the... the yeah, I'm not going to do it this time. They were either angry using the elevator or were behind when you use the elevator. Yeah, I didn't know it was an elevator. I thought it was another teleport. Come on. All right, well, fuck you guys. No, get over here. Now we can use it. Motherfucker. Did someone just fall off the edge because they're being annoying? Do we get to ride these? Fuck yes. Oh, hell yeah, dog. Every player has to use the ID key. The dungeon is so weirdly designed. Really? That's really weird. Nope. Was this the original one? Because it had flames on it. Hey, she recognized me. Yes. Hi. She's so happy. Ah, there she is. I trust you recognize our old friend Maggie, was it? They must have shipped her from the century. Did we actually name her? Considering all she's been through, it's a wonder she's still operational. Tough old girl. Yeah, this dungeon aged poorly. Yeah, that was weird. That everyone has to do it? Now that you're suitably armed, you can blast open the bulkhead. The external walkway will take you back there. Hell yeah, let's go mess them up. Me and Maggie. And my 11 other friends. Follow it till you come up upon a way down to the lower level. You're not authorized to operate a suit magic tech armor. What are you talking about? Oop, I almost clicked the dismount button. Cannon stream. Is that the laser beam? Bing, 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 bing. Meow. <laughs> Dang. How come my cannon doesn't work? cannon doesn't work. That's annoying. Oh, it's an aim. Okay. Ah, my stream was the shoot. Got it. No sprint button, huh? I want to see these things run. See, now that that one was just an auto, man, there's like four different ways to transport in this one. Boom. The big man. Ow, he punched me.
have to click like seven times for it to work. I got punched. Bulkhead is composed of a special alloy. Extremely tough. Ordinary fire won't leave a mark, I'm afraid. You'll need to divert all power to the Magitek Cannon, as I did so memor memorably once before. No, Maggie's gonna go down. As I recall, the armor's core is like to expire from the strain, but there's no help for it if we want to press on. No! Now listen well. Press the control, engage, answer lead, then fire away. Don't mind the warning lights. Really? Don't mind the warning lights? That, that sounds safe. Don't mind the warning lights. That's what I should do. I should do. How could it make a phone? No, Maggie! I'm actually upset. She's just sleeping. You're natural at this. All right, the way's clear. But just you and your own two feet, so be careful. Yeet. Getting close. Oh my god, cutscenes upon cutscenes. That little guy. Look at him. You have been leaving a fine mess everywhere you go. <gasps> Look at her hair, it's cute. Is someone there? I love an old friend. How it warms a heart to hear your voice again, once again, after all these years. Nero, is that you? You sound well. It would seem this savage land agrees with you. The highest ranking tribunus of the 14th. It was, it was you all this time? Tell me, Garland, how do you know, intend to keep all the glory for yourself? Uh, what? You've lost me. He doesn't need to be megaphone when he's talking like that. Don't play the fool with me. Ever since the Academy, I've been condemned to live in your shadow. By all objective measure, I was the more talented of the two of us. Yet the fact counted for naught beside your privileged birth. You were admired as a young prodigy simply because your father was the great Midas Nan Garland. When you defected, I felt sure my star would finally rise. But by disappearing, you acquired the status of a legend. Your rep reputed genius gaining credence merely by dint of your absence. Instead of cursing you for a traitor, the people actually came to think even more fondly. To this day, you are still the young prodigy of the Magitek. I, meanwhile, have never been made to feel second rate. I, who have continued to serve our nation faithfully. Whenever I fail to excel, why, it is only be to, to be expected. Yet when I exceed all reasonable expectations, people proclaim that I walked in the footsteps of the great Sid non bloody Garland. Nero, I I don't know what to say. They're trying to make you relatable to all these characters, huh? It matters not what wait what I achieve achieve. Your existence has rendered mine worthless. Even Lord Van Belsar Bale, saw fit to offer you a place at his side. And this in spite of your betrayal. Did he extend any such offer to me, the man who has remained loyal to him for all these years? Why no, you did not. A bunch of whiny children. Long have I endured this injustice, but no more. Lord Von Balisar is in the midst of activating the fully powered ultimate weapon. It is my magnum opus, the creation that will win me the recognition I am due. I will not let anyone interfere. Nero. Yeah. What are you? Oh. Ever since I set foot in this benighted land, I have watched you. Every move you have made, every step you have taken, 
Every step you take. You have fought failed icons, a feat made possible by the Echo, a peculiar power which shields you from their corrupting influence. It is of little wonder that my lord has taken an interest in you. As have I, if truth be told, it is my desire to harness your power for use in the ultimate weapon. I like his helmet a lot. Really cool. Is that a giant ass cannon that just dropped in front of him? Nope, it's a hammer. He's, he went full Reinhardt. Should I succeed, Lord Bale, sir? Well, surely take notice. Besides this, Garland's achievements will be the OPS child's play. Mammy, bitch! Come, adventurer, and yield to me the secrets of your power. I hope his little thing opens up into like an eyeball. Literally more cutscenes than dungeon here. You're not kidding. We fighting. I don't know what that's going to do, but I'm assuming DPS needs to take care of it. Ah. Okay, I'm going to use that one ability so I can't get knocked back. That one. clap it changes nothing you sure about that who turned out the lights he's gone big cannon <laughs> Ultimate weapon is activated and it brims with the power of icons. Nothing can withstand its might. We'll see about that. Whoa, their staff is cool. Hello? Hey, here. Are you all right? Whoa, her eyes are cool. Oh, those are the dragon people. What up, Nero? Fled, damn it. In the instant prior to the blackout, the instruments detected a massive power surge from the cheapest chambers. Yep, coming. Guys, it's certain to be there. We have no time to waste. Word arrived from the Alliance a short while ago. It seems the Order of the Twin Adder has completed the blockade of Castrum Sentry. Good job, guys. What hands they hand spare are hastening their way even as we speak, and likewise for the Maelstrom. All that's left is to destroy the ultimate weapon. We got this. I should warn you, the chamber... The chamber which douses the target appear, appears to be saturated with aetheric energies. There's bound to be heavy interference. But even if we lose contact, we must go on. Just don't do anything I wouldn't do, alright? Okie dokie. Now what? I'm gonna follow this guy. There's a terminal over there. Can we activate that? Yep. It's lazy. Waiting for other people to do it. There was a wait. Look for the lift's control panel. Oh, he's doing it himself. It's fine. This whole dungeon is just boss fights. After the initial wave of dudes. It's like the elevator in Full Metal Alchemist. We're going to fight Gaius and Ultima at the same time? Damn. Thanks, buddy.
I like how we just stopped talking. Oh. What's up, dude? We thought you were gonna be down there. Tell me for who oh, he's Hawk. Is that gonna be an actual answer? Is it? Huh? Mm -hmm. Look at us kicking ass. I don't even respond. Aorzea's unity is forged of falsehoods. Its city states are built on deceit. And its faith is an I've been robbing these pretzels lately. They just hit. It is not but a cobweb of lies. To believe in Aorzea That's a gun. is to believe in nothing. I really like her. She's cute. Very cute hair. The purple hair, the yellow eyes. Well done. I'm going to redo my character and give myself heterochromia, which I was supposed to have from the beginning. And I just forgot. a long ass elevator and when the dust of battle settles it is never the strong who dictate the fate of the weak <laughs> knowing this when a single path is open to the infinite ruler that of false worship a path which leads to innovation you're impotent Thing looks like it would snap in half. Are we gonna fight on this elevator? Oh shit. I'm getting experience for all this. That's crazy. Okay, the elevator is a little bigger than I thought it was. Oh shit, I didn't mean to use that. God damn it. Push the wrong one. I'm assuming we get him out of that. Is that a friendly thing? Oh. Have you be done by this minute out? Did you need to restart? No. I did a I did some purple things. Fates. Your 
and then and watching all the cutscenes. Million cutscenes of Birch. Just gonna let him leave? He's gonna go get into Ultima right now. Told you. Oh, I need to go turn in my achievement points. I forgot you could do that. I wonder what I could get. Look at the little lava fill with the purple and white hair you'll see in Birch. Her. She's cute. She's got gold eyes. Oh, look at those pixels. Those ones too. Allow me then, hero, to do that which you will not. There she is. Look at her. She's adorable. Sword is bigger than him. We just let him walk into this room, dude. Oh, another elevator fight. Got a limit break a few times. facing away from me if I'm five year aggro. Ah, back here. There you go. Look at me, uh, asshole. Almost did it again. Yeah, don't look away from me. Unless that's my other my friend. Or my the other tank. Ow, it doesn't hurt. Ow, it doesn't hurt. do now ouch okay I'm gonna start using my heels whoa Titan showed up Oh, we're knocking him out. Okay, got it. Look 
at me tanking like a boss. Serena, you're getting your ass kicked. Probably shouldn't stand in front. But the ultimate weapon is all powerful. Why does my enemy still stand? Because we're awesome and you don't know how to target healers. Give my secrets. So, this is what empowers her. No. Beyond mortal limits. I just got so much swag. It's pumping out my ovaries. Come at me. Of darkness must needs be brought to bear upon the shield of light. And so it shall. For the ultimate weapon is host to a power of which you are as yet ignorant. Thanks. I, I think she looks cool. Finally got a set of gear that looks dope. Something I don't want to transmog immediately. The heart of Sabik. It is the weapon's core, an enigma whose surface even the vaunted scholars of ancient Alec failed to scratch. Oh no, it's gonna open. Magic within has lain dormant for eons. We're gonna let these guys talk. Going full DBZ here. A spell Power of Voodoo. Without parallel. Ultima. Is it gonna be green? The life force of the primals for no other reason but to quicken the core. For the true power of the Ultima weapon lies. Gotta do the BBEG. Yeah. Big bag arms. evil guy monologue. Just like, why? Why do we gotta let him talk? Did you just like move him away? No more than uh, is necessary. He, he went full like angel born. devil thing. You're gone. The hour is at hand. Behold, but a sliver of my god's power. Uh oh. Uh oh. From the deepest pit of the seven hells to the very pinnacle of the heavens, the world shall tremble. Unleash oh shit. Ultima. Where did the shield come from? Yeah, I said that with the last ones. Like, this elevator ride is crazy long. Seems very inefficient. Holy shit! Who shielded us? You're a boss. You stole it. Did you show up? <laughs> Bad guy, evil laugh. Such devastation. This was not my intention. Oh, he's gonna turn on him. The task of keeping your champion alive has exhausted what strength ah, you have. It was the, the crystal that protected me. Van Belzar, your enemy's shield is broken. Uh oh. The rest I leave. You're my enemy now. Punch him in the face. I think the ride is over now for the meme line. The penis mightier. Adventurer, let us find the answer together. What a perfect circle of fire.
as they say in the Bible. Come at me, bitch! Let's go! Up, bro. Uh, there it goes. That was weird. Okay, then. Am I standing on fire? I'm a little worried. Oh, right around me. That one's going to go through me. Oh, dodge. Look at me dodging. Quick on my toes. Quick on my toes. Quick on my toes. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. They're everywhere. Ah! Motherfucker. Oh, shit. Someone better take aggro. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. I literally can't dodge. Can't do shit. Are DPS supposed to be killing those things? Because I literally can't do shit. Can't even use my heal. Don't like that. DPS, I hope you're supposed to be doing something and you hope you're doing it because that shit is happening here. All right, using my ability. Bam! All right, someone just mass healed me. Thank you. Oh, let's go! DPS was killing them, but now people just rush the boss. Yeah. Kind of figured. That's what happens with first end game content. We just wiped out his whole fucking the group of people. The frail, and the frail lead the people astray. Unless a man of power rests control, the cycle will never be broken. You, you of all people, must see the truth in this. You who have the strength to rule. Look at that guy wants it. Self destruct. What does it do? What's up, bitch? Pathetic. You boasted of unrivaled power. You were entrusted with the ultimate weapon. The ultimate magic. And still, you failed. So much for the glory of man. Are you not human? <clears throat> the to fight you now. Balance afflicting the planet must be redressed. Okay, want to be self It is permitted to worsen the very laws of existence, both etheric and physical will be warped beyond all recognition. Know you the root of this corruption? Hydaelyn. I really like that name, Hydaelyn. Like a parasite, she
she must be burned out if the planet is to recover. And not but the return of the one. You don't need a burnout God parasite. Sometimes you can take a pill. Her complete excision. Yet to pave the way for the master's return, a chaotic conflict. Would you slip there and stand here and let them talk? About, and that will necessitate the presence of the primals. Needless to say, both you and your scion accomplices cannot be suffered to interfere in this endeavor. Oh, music kicking in. You will not leave this. Place oh God, another one. Here we go. Oh no, your glowy fake mask. It's a tiny ass shield, bro. It is past time your flame was extinguished. <laughs> Bringer of light. Alright, bitch, let's go. Lana Laha bread. I don't know what's happening, happening, happening. I don't know what's happening. Da, 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 da. But I'm tanking. I'm doing the things. All right, he's going to have a crazy form because we're kicking his ass. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Pop it again. Get wrecked. Pop it again. Get wrecked. Really? He had no mechanics. Except for he, he had like little pools of bad. A healer died? How did a healer die? Standing in the pools of bad, probably. Life is stream. Library is a wind down. Yeah, I can see that. I have more sparkles, that means I'm more strong. If thou wouldst pierce the shadows, make thee Yo, give it. Light. light blade for me? Oh wait, I'm going Super Saiyan. Oh! Yeah, what are you doing? Knowledge is power and friendship is magic. <laughs> Whoa. What? Was oh, that your soul? It hit you so hard and knocked your soul out? Look at the shiny crystals. Told you my shiny's bigger. This is a shiny measuring contest right here. Oh, get fucked, bitch! Soul Hadoken, get wrecked. I don't remember Lawbread was possessing Thancred. I thought they were the same person. Oh, we just needed to break your necklace. 
Got it. Holy f fuck, that was all cutscene. Here, I'll commendate you. The, both the tanks are left here. <laughs> there you go, buddy. Please commendate me. Boo. I did! I got two! Oh, that means I'm not at 69 anymore. Bummer. I tanked that shit. It's getting hot in here. Sid. <gasps> Maggie, you're fine. I love you. Oh, who's the goodest girl? Beep, beep. Yeah, let's get out of here. It's hot in this armor. Oh, she does run. Look at her go. Oh, he's not dead. Yet. And so my conquest ends, Sid. Talking to Sid, I kicked your ass. In smoke. Blood and fire. Long ass elevator shaft. Come on, Aggie. We gotta go. Here. Feel. Think. Taste. No. Warrior of light, beloved daughter. Prelude! The darkness hath fled before the unclosed brilliance of thy spirit. Yet it lingereth still beyond the sight of men in forgotten corners of the world. In the depths of the abyss yet resideth the Dark One, watchful ever. Till this evil be cast out, never shall the world know aught but a passing peace. Fuck, I'm tiny. Yet for the present, or, no, actually, that thing's massive. Shineth all the realm of Eorzea. With thee at its heart. From sparkling moat shall it swell to glorious sun, and all the world shall bask in its warmth. I do beta. Look how small I am. Blessings and joy be upon thee. Go forth, my child, and be as a beacon of hope for Eorzea. The song makes me want to play seven. Through all the days of thy life. If you guys want to see me go full fangirl, fanboy, whatever, you have me play seven, you just get all giddy. My lady. All twin adder units have fallen back to the outer perimeter. Nice. The flames have completed their withdrawal, General. Admiral, all hands accounted for. Did you say Admiral? I shouldn't make talk. I can't speak tonight at all. She's still in there. Sid, has there been no word? Nothing. Nothing at all. Damnation! She's going to make it. I know she is. Ida is right. We must have faith. I hate that saying. Sid, can they not? We must have faith. That doesn't do anything. Enterprise? 
I believe so hard that they'll make it alive. Well, that's good and dandy, but it does nothing to help the situation. That adventurer and the Scions are as the warriors of light reborn. We cannot abandon them to their fate. Not again. I wholeheartedly agree. But flying into the midst of that would only add to the fireworks. You said you wanted to do fireworks there must earlier. Be something we can do. Please, Mother Hydalin. Please light her way through the darkness. I'm just like, what are you guys talking about? If thou would see thy companions return safe to thee, Dude. reach out to them now. That look into the light, my child. They say that in Horizon Zero Dawn, but it's creepier. Man. Look to the light, child. Or he, I think he says son. That's a great game. Oh. It's cool. No one used any magic or anything to speed me up or block them in the fire. I got this. Don't worry. Yeah. See, Moira knows the line in the beginning. Turn your face to the sun. Yes, I love that line, dude. Survive. Well. Was playing Minecraft lurking. I appreciate it. You heard Horizon Zero Dawn. You had to pop in. I understand. I understand completely. Welcome home. Can we be girlfriend girlfriend now? I'd be okay with that. Okay, it's playing the Final Fantasy music. <laughs> Whoa. Was there a drag? Is that metal or is there like a dead dragon up there? I also queued up for the dungeon just now. For that one? Oof. We both know that was your fault. Thank the twelve, we're safe. Hey, we did it. We beat the game. There's a dead dragon up there, yes. Ah. Though the crystal that bound Thancred is no more. I doubt we can say the same. Nobuo Umatsu, I love you. You make amazing music. And even if we could, we know that he is not alone. Confounded Assians. This is more donuts. <laughs> God may be unknown to us. <laughs> what you go? Is Stinky. Suffice it to say, it would be folly to assume that they no longer pose a threat. Nevertheless. Was that all the voices for Heidelin? For now, we must savor what peace we have won. However ephemeral. Do you see, Grandfather? Our first step towards realizing the oh, those are probably all just voice actors for uh, different languages. Oh, it's voice in four languages? Got it. I'm assuming second one is uh, English. The Scions of the Seventh Dawn, along with our champion, have delivered us from darkness. Let their shared victories serve to remind us of our shared history. And let their bravery in the face of adversity inspire future generations. Doubt not, the realm that will need be the bravery case. in the days to come. Old rifts threaten to divide us within our walls, while hordes of beastmen claw at our gates. 
And though the Black Wolf be slain, the rest of the pack remains. Yet no foe need we fear, so long as we stand as one. So long as the Scions stand for peace. <laughs> so long as our champion stands fast. For there exists no adversity over which we may not jointly prevail. No longer can we turn a blind eye to the suffering of our allies. No nation stands alone. If one should fall, Everybody's so English, French, German, yeah. Eorzea is our shared home. For any one of us to know peace, so too must our neighbor. There he is, Sam Regal. Just as we join in solidarity before you. Simony B, I know that name. So too shall our grand company. Who's Simony B? Also, didn't they spell Regal wrong? Isn't it R E I G E L? But for the good of all the realm. Change will not come overnight. Yet I foresee a day, not so very far from now, when the lines that divide our lands fade, and all of Eorzea is one. It has been but five short years. Whoa, since the CJ3, of wow. Five years since the advent. Of the seventh is that his name? era. No victory, however sweet, can wash away our bitter sorrows. No triumph can reclaim those we lost. Yet do not presume you honor them by dwelling on the past. It was not the past they had been there as a good girl. You would repay their sacrifice by looking to the future. A future united, as the warriors of light united in the champion. Now is the time for us to rise as one, bearing all of Eorzea on our shoulders. Five years ago, Eorzea bore witness to the end of the Sixth Astral Era. Now, the Seventh Umbral Era draws to a close. Yet we come together not to glory in its end, but to mark a new beginning. Oop. <laughs> Shoots friend. Let it be writ that on this day, by the light of the crystal, Eorzea ushered in a new era. Boom, boom, just shoot your friends. <gasps> they said the name. Why is Minfilia so hot? God damn. I want to be able to romance her. Go buy a house out in the country. Oh my god, title, title drop. <laughs> Alright, I gotta look that up. Hold on. Sim Money B. Sam Regal. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, they they misspelled his name. That's funny. It's R I E G E L. Who's Sim Money B? Oh. They literally just do a realm we're born? What? I know her name. Oh, that's Alice. Well, I didn't know that. I, I was more looking at the name that I knew. Thanks for the GGs. Hold on. Reminds you of what? Start with the add a plenty of green onions, a spoon of minced garlic, and a gun. <laughs> What's that from? That food looked delicious, by the way. Hey, 
Yay, we beat it. Yes, we did, Rooster. How you doing? How's work? Some call you. Oh, absolutely, I would, but I don't think that's coming for a while. I mean, what you could do is you play right now for free. You just make a character. And then when they make bunny people free, then you just pay, what, the 10 bucks to change your race. Easy clap. Mitsuhisha Ibi Sumoto. That's a cool name. So You're just changing race? Yeah. You get a free body change once you finish the main game. Yeah, but isn't that just a... You have to stay the same race, though? Or can you actually switch race? Because I know you can switch gender. Well, right. But the, the thought here is... Um, nope, the whole thing. Damn, there you go, Moira. Because uh, Moira... Um, doesn't want to buy up to the expansion. So the thought is... You just play for free. All the way up to the end. And then maybe by then... Funny people will be free. And if they are, then you just use your thing to change your, your, your race. If not, then you have it. And then when they finally do become free, you just change your race. Because I think you'd really dig this game, Moira. For serious. This is a cool song. <laughs> you want your bunny girl? Yep. Yeah, that, that bunny is going to be a while for sure. But... The very least, we'd be we would get Moria to play with us, possibly, and then they would just have some levels, and you know they wouldn't be so very far behind or whatever. And then it's like, cool, buttony people are free, boom, race switch. You've never been able to log in? Uh, um, oh yeah, the queues are better. The queue took me like a minute and I had to log out because the sound stopped working and it was literally, I was 53 in queue. The queues are, they're fixed. Hey, Rooster, uh, or Birch, when are you... What, actually, Trinant, you might know this too. Anyone that knows the game. So if you get the the expansion classes... I don't... I can't think of... I don't... I know, like, the Reaper is one. Do... When you pick up that class, does it start at, like, level 50 or whatever that you get it at? Because they're expansion ones? Or do they start at literally level 1? I would assume the prior. That they start at higher level. I want the bunny girl shoes for an outfit, but it's a race exclusive. Oh, really? I'm nervous to play a whole... Name. Dude, I'd be happy to play with you, Moira. Like, this... But I, I'm pretty sure I told you this before, but... One character can be every class, and they all have individual levels. So, I'd be more than happy to switch to one of my baby character Or, one of my baby classes and just run around with you. And they, they do a pretty good job at explaining things. And for the most part, if you just get overwhelmed, if you just do the main story quest, quest you're going to get up to level 50 with it. It starts high level, high level, cool. 10 levels before current expansion, usually. Got it. 30 for Heaven Sword, 50 for Stormblood, 60 for Shadow Ring, 70 for Endwalker. Gotcha. So how is, um... Heaven Sword's an expansion, right? How's Heaven Sword and Stormblood for uh, expansions? I heard Shadowbringers is fantastic, and I've, I've heard good things about Endwalker. But it's pretty new, so I don't know if it's generally... Like, if it's generally one of the better ones or something. 
Downside, you can't be start with those classes. You correct. Heaven Sword is really good. Stormblood is pretty okay. Okay, that's cool. So, I can look forward to going through Heaven Sword then. Also, Moira, um, even if we, we like, so say like you wanted to do some dungeons or whatever and you were level 10, I could literally, any of us could be on our like level 50 and we could still queue with you and it de-levels us to about, to, to the level range. So it's not like you're going to get sped run or anything. It's, it's great. It really, in, they really took the time to implement a system into the game that you can play with anyone and all your friends at any time i mean as long as you're not going too far up in level you can go down in level and play with them like every expansion is better than a realm reborn cool Kazu Yoshi, Mochizuki. I want to know how the closed captions are doing that. Oh my god, it was right! That's amazing. Kazuya Miyashita. Holy shit! That's amazing! Yoshikazu Kawahama. Okay, that one said Yoshikazu Bahama. Aki Takeda. Wow, that's amazing. Tashio Morochi. Long ass credits. Have a good one, Rooster. Be safe at work. I'm gonna see if my character is still there, still in there somewhere. Heck yeah, dude. Also, I'm in. Discord if in, uh, anyone was wanting to play. The credits are Guinness World Record long. So now that it's recent. G really? They were the long... Like, are you making a joke or is that for serious? Like, they, they broke a record. I remember... I don't remember, Doom 2016, those credits were literally over 10 minutes. Boopa Snoots, what's up, Lonnie? Your Kit Kat's out in the cold. Wait, are you talking about cats or like the candy bar? Because cold Kit Kats slap. You order matcha Kit Kats. I got those in um one of the one of the Japanese uh, snack boxes that uh, Space sent us. Those were delicious. Izumi Tsukushi. Itomi Orajiri. Orajiri. Aoyagi. You don't want to ruin the story for yourself? Oh, you're fine. Yeah, glad uh, you didn't get any spoilies. Holy crap, though, Lonnie, that end is like, it's like two hours of cutscenes. Not really. It's two hours of the end story, but like, I swear 40 minutes of it is cutscene. Yeah, what's the actual credit length? Angelo! Welcome to the stream! Remind me who you are. I know your name. Okay. What? No. 
The credits are not an hour and 30 minutes long. Or are you talking? Is that the end of the, the mission? It's an hour and 38 minutes of cutscenes. There's no way the credits are an hour. This part is the short part. What? Game hey, Masters. Got GMs up in here. People normally call you daddy. <laughs> You'd recommend watching the credits until the reason. Okay. Well, I thought that said Tifa. Thaddeus Phillips. Thaddeus is a crazy name. Oh, now going through Square Enix Europe. Sebosan Berthelsen. Also, by the way, that dicks per link. Um, if you're a sub, every month you get a new crate, so, like, make sure you guys, every month, you go in there, if you're subbed, and just get your free crate. Use it. You made a white mage? Nice! That was, a. I was, Conjurer was my first class, um, on, on this character. And then, I ended up picking up the rest of the classes, and I was like, fuck, I just need to burn through the main storyline. And my, uh, the queue times for dungeons were, like, nearly instant as tank, so... It's funny, the main st the main class I started with was not the class I finished the game with. I met the guy who's speech in that dungeon. Where he's all like, not but a cobweb of lies. I mean, uh, Dragoon? Is that what that is? But also, I have a tank and leveling a healer. Also, I haven't figured out the... Memorized the symbols for the classes yet. That's Dragoon? Okay. That, that's the spear person, right? Yeah, Lancer. Dragoon is the the specialty class, right? Is that what those are called? The secondary class? Yeah, Lancer into Dragoon. It's kind of a bummer that it's pointless to carry on leveling like the base class after you get the, the secondary, you know? Angelo, you gotta remind me. I know your name, but I can't remember for what reason. I mean, yeah, technically the base class is still leveling. Wait. No. It's not leveling with my main class, right? Or the secondary class? Like, if I took off... If I, if I switched back to a Marauder, my Mara Marauder would be like level 40. Still, right? Like, if you don't equip your job stone, you'll be the same level. Oh! Okay. See, I thought they were... But... The opposite isn't true. Like, you can level Marauder, and the secondary... Your job class won't be leveling, right? I think I figured that out on accident, or I got confused between my classes. You're on Primal, right, Moria? Takuya Shibata. Just cause, what's that? Shanghai Winking Entertainment.
Angelo, you were the partner of someone, if I remember correctly. Were you, um... Were you Sabrina's partner? My brain is trying to put pieces together. If you skip the credits, you'll skip to the next part of the credit. Yeah, I know. 14 cues, that's definitely... Yeah, right? Yeah, the, the cues are way better now. I spent a lot of... I did a lot of kick-ass work to make the cues reasonable again. Man, this fucking hangnail. Told you, man, it's like immediate. No more background pictures. Christoph. So can I guess why the credits are lo so long? Looks like they're listing out literally everything. Oh, look! We're at the end. I was just about to be like, why is it centered? It hasn't been centered this whole time. But it just, suddenly it just looked really weird over in OBS. Oh, not this part? I don't know. There's no way there's like an hour long. Do they literally go through and list every player? You can skip to it. That's cool. Every player in 1.0. Really? Every player in 1.0 that beat the game? Oh, wait, 1.0 was before it became Realm Reborn, correct? The game that was pretty much a failure and then they remade it. Is that correct? Holy shit. Okay, so I would not be a part of this one. Let me scroll. Raging Dragon. Because I started... Uh, this one in Realm Reborn, so I wouldn't be here for any of my characters. Holy shit. That's amazing. I would hate to put in all those numbers. Or, <gasps> words. How do I be done? Yeah, I'm not. Sorry. Those are just players. They don't need credit. Okay. Well, what's this? These are people that worked on the game. Yes. Oh, finally that part of my neck popped. Hakashige.
AMD. What about giant ass wasted space? Mr. Housing, Mr. Headshot. Yosuke. Also, they opened up the, the free-to-play stuff again. But yeah, one hour, 38 minutes. Only Mighty, no... Only Mighty, number nine beats, I think. Because MM9 credits backers. MM9, I have no idea what that is. Oh, only MM9. Mighty number nine. Is that a is that a game? Because all the backers they list okay, I think I understand what you're saying. I just don't know what the game you're talking about. Like damn it, no one to no one to kill. Wait. My headache's back. Can't trust any of these people. Goes on a murder spree and murders everyone. Mighty Number no. 9 was a Mega Man spiritual successor Kickstarter by one of the original Mega Man makers. Wow. It disappointed? Oh, bummer. Oh, man, it's a Mega Man! If anyone knows the reference there. Riding on cars! Jump and shoot, man! What is it? Yeah. Yeah, lemons! What the hell? What the hell? Flashback! This could be the part where they blow your fucking mind. No I'm just quoting that whole fucking where is video. He coming from? Yeah, good old sequelitis. Dude, you get awesome points. Dread tidings, chaos, and carnage. Son of a bitch, we literally just finished all that. It's an abomination. A primal, a primal has awakened. We literally right after we finished all that shit, and it's like just drops you into something else. My God, that's dirty. Am I in prison now? Nice shoes. A new bad guy emerges. It's motherfucking you! Oh, you're in prison. You're fine. No, who's gonna let you out? Who the fuck are you? Cars, Bahamul, move. Who are you, wannabe cloud? Oh, I'm supposed to click. Or twins. Igiorm? That's a name. Oh god, more. Triplets! It's Advent Children, the brothers. Lowe's and. I remember Lowe's. Kadaj. I don't remember the other one. I'm not crying! Holy shit, okay. The post. Shit, they're not dead yet. Giving you major protagonist syndrome? <laughs> yeah, you're very important in this game. Where's Zodiac? Is that like a Zodiac, but hard work? The Zodiac? It's Mama's! And thus did Dawn break on Realm Reborn. 
where is the light? There's always shadow. Or where there is light, rather. Oh, God. Yeah, this game does not give a fuck about the fact that there's a bajillion other warriors of light. Yeah. Oh, see? Those two commendations knocked me up from 69. I got nothing from that except experience. Clappies. Clappies. Hi. Can we go on a date now? He's like, leave. We need some private time. The Archons have conducted a preliminary investigation of the origin of the roar that rang out during the celebration. Their findings strongly suggest that a new primal has appeared. The roar generated distinctive wave patterns in the Aether, a pattern observed only once before the, in history. Five years ago, to be precise. Bahamut? I should like to think it mere coincidence, yet we cannot discount that possibility. Well, I trust I need say no more. At great sacrifice, we have delivered Eorzea from the threat posed by the Empire and the Primals, and thereby secured peace. We cannot well allow the realm to be plunged into chaos once more. Fuck, no break? You have given your all for our cause, risking life and limb on I know not how many occasions, yet our struggle continues, and we need you now no less than before. Please continue to stand with us, and together we shall safeguard the future of the realm. Of this very star. I mean, if you want to hang out with me more, just say so. It's good. Yeah, I, and technically, in reality, yeah, there was a, a couple year period of break. You can now fly well mounted. Yes! I gotta see the Chonky Boy fly! Cool, you didn't have to fucking do any quests for it? That's amazing. Hell yeah. Flying mounts. Sick. I can fly again. Or now. Uh... Is she gonna talk? Mm, Faith, it pleases me to see you well. It's her! Waddle, waddle, waddle. No oh, excuse me for interrupting Faith. My lady, the gentleman from Ashgana Experts. Exports has just left. I thought that said esports at first. I understand now why you didn't want to receive him. He's kind of a dick. You did well, Tataru. Please inform the guards that we will not be receiving any further guests this evening. Thank you, my lady. She's so fucking cute! Ever since we defeated Gaius Van Belsar and destroyed his ultimate weapon, the eyes of the world have followed our every move, scarce remembering to blink. Where once we worked in secret, with precious few friends and all too many enemies, we are now besieged by benefactors, each one more eager than the last to offer us his complete support. A true embarrassment of riches. Of course, every promise of patronage comes with a price. Some make it their intentions known from the start, while others endeavor to engage us more subtly. Just at how they will, the message is ever the same. We shall help you, but only if you help us. Fuck them. The gentleman Tataru spoke of was more brazen than most. In exchange for certain supplies, he would have us resolve a business dispute. Fuck that. Naturally, I refused him, as I would have every other merchant of his ilk. Alas, the syndicate's overtures are not so easily rejected the fuck is that? When we formed the Signs of the Seventh Dawn, it was the goal of serving Eorzea, not the interests of individual Eorzeans. Exactly. Our neutrality is fundamental to our cause. In my heart, I know this to be true, and yet, and yet, if accepting these offers of patronage could empower us to do greater good, might they not warrant greater consideration? Nope. We're neutral. Our, our Baldizian colleges have been generous beyond measure, but we have cannot expect them to... Forgive me. I did not mean to burn you so. Now you're good. Yet, my urge to share this dilemma may not be so wholly misguided. Might I impose upon you to consult the others? 
They're like to have their own opinions on this matter. How much more do I think I'll play? What time is it? 9.30? Uh, maybe a little bit longer. Depends on how much I get sucked in. Also, Moira, if you're on, let me let me add you as friend. Uh, I always forgot how to do this. Player search. All right, Moira, you have to tell me your character's name. Also, you can leave now. Oh wait, I gotta go this way. Slaps of this. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Okay. It's you, bad man. Fortune begets power, and power of fortune. That we, and especially you, have powers beyond doubt. The question is what to do with it. You may be interested to know that there is a growing belief amongst the refugees that Alamigo could be liberated, if only the science would commit their strength to the cause. Yet this is but one of the many causes we stand at a crossroads face. Each path is paved with good intentions, but where they lead is far from clear. Says Mr. Dude that was possessed. We call our meeting with Admiral shortly after the Lominsen said word of the summoning of Titan. And mayhap you also recall my words to our host. I said unto Marilbib that her people had broken their treaty with the Kobolds and that the Beastmen had just justly responded. That we had been called to intervene in the conflict which he, she herself had invited. I spoke, in short, the truth. And therefore, wherefore did I speak it? Because, owing no allegiance to Limsa, I felt no compulsion to allow the Lominsons to distort the facts to fit a narrative which justified their actions and absolved them of guilt. Upon this subject, Minfilia can expect a similar reply. Our many Dallas alliances with the city-states have already weakened our claim to neutrality, but the path she contemplates would see us relinquish it entirely. Nope, we stay, we stay, uh, neutral in my opinion. I've been receiving lots of gifts lately, but Papa Limo keeps making me send them back. It wouldn't be so bad, but some of them are really nice. I mean, very nearly... Very nearly abandon your principles nice, you know? None can deny that we would benefit from more support, but if it comes at the cost of our principles, neutrality was ever a delicate matter. I've locked... Fuck, misclicked. Quite sure Ida would enjoy the bribes. Although I don't care about Papa Limo, so... It's a lot of the power to extract the co covetous as well as the needy. Thus doth prud prudence dictate that those with power proffer aid in one hand whilst the other rest resteth ever on their hilt. Alas, we have no luxury of time to decipher our petitioners' machinations. Nay, not while the beast tribes do labor unseen, defiant in de defeat to raise up in their fallen primals once more. Doubt not that they shall return, stronger and bolder both, nor that we shall be the ones to meet them. The sacred charge shall ever be ours. It is but a pity we are so few in our, in our fortune so finite. We good? We good. Uh, hold on. How much... Oh, honk. My character and not ID? Yeah, your character. Be sure I've named her after my OC. Okay. Player search. Player search. Search, there it is. Search. Oh, are you not on right now? Oh, honk. I heard that your voice in my head. Now I'm going to use it. I <laughs> gave me a random dose of serotonin. Sweet. You're online. You're on primal. Maybe I didn't do it right. Uh. World. There you go. Nope, none of those. I should be able to add you, even if you're on free. Because I own the game. Okay, that doesn't work. Why isn't that working? Oh, 
Oh, is that not the case, Burst? I thought just, uh... Free accounts could be... Couldn't be, a uh, Friended. Free accounts won't show... Oh, really? Okay, so we have to, I have to find him. And then add him, maybe? Hmm, the situation is not wholly unexpected. I do have given much thought to our organization's future, though it would seem I have reached a different conclusion. They have at his time and made my feelings known to the antecedent. Antecedent. Come along, Faith. Ugh, why are you so important? I can try adding you. Uh, yours won't work, Moira. I know that one won't. Half an odd, Faith? Is that a miss? Oh, wait. Is that a miss? A miss? You desired counsel, and so you should have it. Minfilia, the signs of the seventh dawn must leave Ulda. We must do what? So long as we remain within Ulda territory, we will never be free to act with impunity. Moving our headquarters to Vesper Bay only delayed the inevitable. We have demonstrated our capabilities, and the Syndicate has taken note. It will not suffer our organization to remain independent now. We are far too dangerous for that. All right, he speaks smart. Surely real, you realize they are the reason Vesper Bay still lacks an aetherite. They know full well how beneficial one would be to our cause. Which is why it and other favors will be denied us unless we cooperate. If Uldah is no longer suitable, where would we, you have us go? Experience has taught us that the appearance of neutrality is as important as the reality. Accordingly, we must keep each of the great nations at arm's length and plant our banner in a place which all agree to be beyond their borders. Mordana. We're going to Mordana. Revenant's toll, to be precise. It lies within neutral territory and offers an essential facilities we require. By the way of an additional benefit, it is also frequented by a veritable legion of adventurers who may serve to supplement our ranks. And sometimes I click and it doesn't work. Click! Fuck! I am, of course, conscious of the fact that we have developed a certain bond with Ulda and her people over the years. I am clicking. Clicking! Motherfucker! Jeez. But I truly believe this is the, be the best course of action. As you yourself observe, we have an invaluable ties to the local community. Forged through years of concerted effort, Ulda. Ulda is our home. Alphanod, to cast aside everything we've built and start anew in that desolate wasteland would be beyond reckless. The decision is yours to make Antis antecedent. And only is that you recall the shared purpose for which we first moved us to found the signs of the seventh dawn, and which moved you to found the path of the twelve ere that. We aspire to an ideal, you and I, just as my grandfather did. That makes us more than mere comrades in arms. We are as much your family as... That will be all, Alphanod. I'm sure you have some familiar affairs of your own to attend to. Your concern is most generous, but... I have left them in the hands of men better suited to the task than I. I could not very well allow my personal affairs to come before the needs of the Order, after all. I've encountered people, oh yikes. Like, players? Is that what you're talking about? Sure, I'll take a ring. So many, yep. They're trying it, Trin. Come on, I deleted that. Whoops. Nice. Oh, another ring. Living Ulda has truly has it truly come to this. Hmm? Oh, face, pray attend to Alphanod. He's engaged in a business or other and requires your assistance. Pray be on your way. Alpha Not waits upon you and I have much to think about. Oh, and tell him he shall have my answer in due time. And why the fuck did I have to talk to you? Okay, it's fine. My main is on a different data center though. It's fine, the 
apparently they're uh, they're not merging data centers, but you'll be able to play with anyone across data centers. They're working on it now, which is pretty sweet. Confound it! She knows that what must be done, and she still hesitates, all because of these fanciful rumors. Hmm. I should explain. Minfilia's mother, well, adoptive mother, was among the great many who perished during the calamity. That's the name. Flamelun was her name. So you may know her better as the songstress of Ulda. She was a performer of a singular talent and much beloved by the people of Eorzea, not to mention a certain Charlean minstrel. As you may imagine, the news of her passing was greeted with shock and disbelief by her adoring followers, many of whom were soon to acknowledge what had happened. That her body was never found only served to encourage speculation. Nah, she just ascended. Minfilia too struggled at first to accept the fit truth, but as Flumen's absence stretched from months to years, she saw there could be no other explanation. Until recently, at any rate, for any reason, rumors have once again begun to circum circulate that Flumen is alive and well. One of our informants, Father Iliad, is said word that a woman matching the songstress's description has been seen as late at the seaside resort of Costa del Sol. If we could succeed in tracking her down, I have no doubt that any worries that now plague Minfilia's heart might be assuage, assuaged. I mean to set forth for Lanazia at once. Let us reconvene there and inquire with Master Egeruju as to the veracity of these rumors. Saw bunny girl now. Wait, that's funny. Uh, okay, I can get out of here now. I want to go fly my chonky boy. I want to see, and I want to see fat cat fly. That is the most important thing right now. Okay. Here we go. Normal chocobo. Chonky boy! Wee! <laughs> look at him! <laughs> Hold on! Wait! Look! No! Stop! I'm getting stuck on things! Oh my god! <laughs> How do we go back down? Z, okay. <laughs> look at him go! Oh! He has cake now! Oh my god! To make him fly, you give him cake. That's amazing. Oh, I gave myself a head rush. Look, it's like, it's right outside of his beak. He's like, give me it. I want it. It's right there. Just lift your chonky head. Just uh, get it. I believe. I believe you can get it. Oh, fucking awesome. Look at him. <laughs> the waddle. Eh. Eh. Oh, I fucking love him. Now, I want to demount. How do I demount? How do I stop flying? Stop flying. How do I stop flying? Fuck. I'm broken. Stop flying. Guys, stop flying. How do I stop flying? I'm on the ground. Wait, maybe I can't stop flying up here. Hold on. There we go. Okay, you can't dismount up there. That was it. Oh, feel better. Look, he's got jet stream. Oh my god, he's got a jet stream. How? Wait, how did I do that? He's got jet stream. Look at him go. These stupid little feet. 
<laughs> oh my god, I love it. Oh. Yeah, we're, we're intended for flights. Yeah, it makes sense. I was like the original. Wow. Oh, that was amazing. I forgot what I was going to actually do. Equip new gear. Nice. Okay, let me check. Yeah, see? Yeah, see, my Marauder is still level 17. No, it's not. It's 52. It doesn't have the same armor, though. Oh, is the other armor, uh... Warrior specific. Got it. Okay. Ugh. That's horrid. Really? Oh, right, because those are lower levels. Those are level 38. So if I subscribe to the game, I'll get all expansions. No. My character's cute, but Squid's not a bunny girl. Did you make a Lollafell? Um, no. Uh, subscribing to the game just gives... I don't know. I don't think there's a reason to subscribe. I mean, you, you can get some... Like, for every certain amount of days that you're subscribed, you can get some in-game content, which I don't think you'd really care about. I think one purchase for all expanse for the upgrade plus sub. That might be true. You might be able to just if you buy Endwalker, I think you get all the expansions. Does that sound about right? Also, where are you, Moira? What in the in the in the world? Because then I, if I find you, I might be able to like right click your character and add you as friend. I'm not sure. I fly. I fly on a fat cat. Whoa! Okay. Oh. That's fucking cool. Little wings come out. Alright. Does things change for other people? No, he just flies. Nothing changes with him. I haven't got the motorcycle yet. Holy crap. Nothing with him. All right, I'm tired of that. Mount. Summon. There you go. Vroom! I'm a flying motorcycle. Vroom! Starting area. Yeah, starting lower decks of Laminza. There's someone wearing a chocobo head playing music. Yes, dude. The the bard class. You can actually play real life songs in the game. It's fucking cool. Uh, teleport. I have that chocobo head. I think, actually, that might be one of the... the things you get. Elspeth the Spira. Is that Magic the Gathering? Okay. Um... So I'm going to look <laughs> the boy. I will look for a chocobo head.
Do you know which side you're on? Fat piggy. Yeah, they're not going to be out there. He's playing the Animal Crossing theme. Yes, yeah, see? You can play real music. Isn't it great? That's that's part of the reason I wanted to play archers because they, they can become the bard. <laughs> Cut to Moyer playing 12 hours straight. Look at the frog costume. That's amazing. What the fuck? They're painting all over the dead body. All right, just go listen for music. Oh, there's a big mogul or moogle. <gasps> Oh, he left. Oh, shit. Six Ventine. All right, I didn't find you. Well, you said that. I was looking for the, the Chocobo head. There you go. All right, I'm running around with the chocobo head. Avatar Bilbo. Jabroni Chan. <laughs> All right, are you in the... The district of the cellar people. The person has a chicken head. Whoa, what's this? Oh, this is the person to turn the things into. This one's not shop. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay, I'll deal with that later. Hey, it's trying it. Wave. Make sure to select it. The... By the Aetherite. Oh, the big one. Okay. Choose the Ironworks category. Yeah, I saw the eye level was higher. Oh, I can buy one piece. An axe. Fifteen more damage than my current one. Interesting. All right, I'll check that out later. You're by the eighth right. Okay, so I'm by one. Although I think there might be two etherites. Right, there's two big ones. What's your character's name? Um, she, or uh, Moira, your, your character's a she, right? Moira's character is on a free, or Moira is on a free account, so we can't find him. Cerberus Blue. Chad lad. <laughs> Son Draku? Is that like Son Gaku? What's that from? I can't remember what that's from. Yeah, what, what's your name in the plaza? Oh, right. You can, you can like, see who's in this area, right? <laughs> you see anyone running around with a chocobo head? I'm gonna run to the, the other shard. Which I 
could have teleported, but I might see you on the way, so. Kane Funk. No chocobo heads. Oh, material molder. Uh, I could probably pay for him to put those things in. Yeah, uh, that's what was going to be my next thing. Is like, I wonder if we're in the, a different instance of the game. Like, because Moira's in, uh, like, new. Maybe the... You got to create or complete a certain number of uh, quests to unlock, like, the whole city something. I don't remember. Man, they're just painting the shit out of this person. Type instance. Instance. You can do that? You're not currently in an instance area. Yeah. Standing by the NPC you mentioned. The guy painting stuff? Which NPC? Healers adjust. It's funny. I signed up at the primal server. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, you're in the primal server group. Um, but we're on the ultra server. Uh, it'll say up in the, the, the top, right? See, mine says ultras. That might be uh, the reason. Oh, yeah, I think I, if I recall correctly, you joined in in the primal server group as a different server because they were accepting new players and there was a bonus to like experience or something if you joined that group. And if that's the case, then I think I can switch to a different server group on the fly or uh, a different server, right? If you click the big crystal world transfer there you go is it another world server oh look they already have it trying it look i can switch to the different server groups hey they implemented it you're on exodus okay oh wait no these are all within the world all right world visit I'm coming. Yeah, that's the world. Yeah, mi mistake. Okay, you buy the Aetherite. You're gonna log back in. I like reading people's names. Coffin Gemini. Candyland. Hey, <laughs> Trinan's back. Morgana Proudmore. Oh, I thought that was you. Dillard Pickles. I should be in that NPC. I'll just skiff if it logs me in the same place. I held skiff. I held skiff. Oh, dad.
She looks cool. I think you saw me? I'm gonna jump. I see you! Ha! Ran! Alright, can I click? Invite to party. Send friend request. Hey! I sent you a friend request! Did it work? Yes! We did it! Okay, so they just make it a pain in the ass. You look cute! Ooh, I like your hair and your makeups. I can't see beyond my giant chocobo head. Okay, what level are you? You're level two. Okay. Let me... Unable to do a quick... Oh, dicks. I can switch to Lancer. Oops. Damn it! I can't switch my inventory. I don't know. I wish it would tell me. I'm guessing it's... Damn it. Alright. I will switch to a class. What class are you? Also, if you want to chat, we're, I'm in Discord. It's up to you, though. Um, I will switch to Lancer, but I gotta make room in my inventory, apparently. Probably my hat. Oops. This might make things easier. Hey! What's going on? Oh, nothing much. I'm getting protagonist syndrome already. Right? <laughs> so much fun. Alright, make sure I have room. Okay, I should be able to switch now. Oh god, oh see what I mean? <laughs> oh my. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I accidentally sold all my lobby gear. <laughs> it's so... <laughs> it's, uh... It's rough. Literally have nothing I can wear. This is fine. It's this fine. fine. Um, so, this is... A, I'm a level 4, so... I can join you up. Whatever you want to do. Trident, also, if you have a lobby level and you want to join, you're welcome to join. Which I should probably invite to party. Hey, I have two buttons. I feel very special. I can't mount? No. Really? I thought I'd be able to mount regardless of my level. That's dumb. There's a person named Enormous Nut. That sounds about right. <laughs> and uh, they're looking for any cute grandma. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to follow you, because I don't know what you need to do. Uh, I don't know where I need to go. That's oh, right. We're in a city. That <laughs> makes sense. Your vendor down the road. <laughs> uh, do I have any... Quest? I have no idea. You have a level 3 punchy punchy? Alright, let me, um... Oh, there goes another funny girl. <laughs> Yeah. This, is, this is gonna torture me every time I see one. <laughs> Did you see the one standing over here looking all boss? Yeah, oh, she, she left. God. Oh, there have been a few, and I just. Dang. There's one! They're sitting down. Oh. And there's another one sitting on their lap. So cute. <gasps> I like her green hair. I'm running around naked, and I don't like it. <laughs> Stinking. Got rid of all my crap. Whoa, she looks awesome. Hi. <laughs> Damn. They out here I too. accidentally got rid of my baby gears. Oh, you got a sprout icon. You're a sprout. Being naked, staring at a bunny girl. <laughs> Okay, so, um, I can switch. Can I switch my main quest? I don't fucking know. I don't know. I'm gonna let you tell us where we gotta go, and then, then I'll know I can pick up quests there. Can you share quests in this game? I, I do not know, but the main quest I have is that I have to visit the Arcanist Guild. That's all I know. Here in Limsa? Uh, I assume so. Okay. Uh, if you click on your, um... 
your main quest button that shows up on your UI somewhere. It'll open up the map and tell where you gotta go. And now it's just where I'm. Ah, I see. Okay. So it's like way out to the west. There's a. East. Okay, where are you trying to. I can actually make my own gear. What am I fucking talking about? That's what I should do. That'd be the, the smart thing to do. Okay. You go do your quest until we gotta leave and let me know. And in the meantime, I'm gonna try to make some gear so I'm not naked. Okay. <laughs> Alright, make a. I gotta make some body. Lancer's. Leather. You the crystal? Okay. Um. Character. Crafting. Wrist guards. Eye patch. Nope. Leather gloves. Oh, fuck me, god damn it. Alright. West of the crystal. Okay. This way. Oh, right. There's people oh, to buy. Trade. Battlecraft. Oh, oh, haha. <laughs> that opened automatically. Okay, I need a level before I can wear this stuff, but <laughs> at least I won't be naked. <laughs> ah. Oh, there you are. Okay. I can teleport. The Arcanist Guild. Yeah, wait till you stand next to next to like Rooster's character. She's huge. You just know it's like naked person running around with a goofy hat. I know who it is. <laughs> how, how did you get little pig? Uh, he's cute. He might have been a quest. He he's just uh he's like the pets in WoW where there's like little minions. You can get different ones. Oh, cute. Like the like Speedy the turtle and stuff in WoW. They're essentially that non-combat pets. Okay. Um, close all that. So what quest are you on? Did she okay, send you off to do something? There's, yeah, um... I have to slay things, I think. Finally my combat tutorial, I'm pretty sure. Sweet. Though I do not. I gotta figure out where this is. Uh, Jay opens your journal if you need it. There you go map 
I have no baby level quests. <clears throat> Oh, that's a while away. Dang. They really want me to walk that whole freaking way, huh? Oh, yeah. You're in the, the time where they're like, they're really drilling into you. Like how much it sucks not to have a mount. And uh, then yeah. Just so you could be like, oh, I got a mount and it's amazing. Oh, enormous nut is back in chat. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Also, you found your sprint button, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Wee. Wee uh, um. Up here. Okay. I hope there's a bridge to this Look at place. that guy! Yo! He's dapper as fuck. I like him. Oh, yeah, that's the dude that was playing the music. Oh, was he? I like him. Yeah, yeah. I like his outfit. That person has a giant scythe. That's cool. Sorry, I'm just talking when I see cool people. Oh, you're good. Yeah, I, I want to be a a bard just so I can like play Tool or something goofy, learn all the I Zelda songs. Here. I'm so confused. Kylie Jenner. Oh my god. Thrashar, Thrashar. Duck Mallard Drip. <laughs> okay. Uh, so it's telling me I don't know how to pronounce this, but I have to go to Lower Lanoskia, Lanashea. I don't know how to pronounce this. Okay, so if you open up your map, yeah. Um, there's like the arrows up here. You can switch yeah. it. Uh, yeah, so then you can switch to lower, and depending if you have, you won't have that teleport. So then, the only downside that I like about this game is you got to find out which one you go to. I'm guessing, okay, so that goes to middle, goes to western. Yeah, this part sucks. I was trying to figure out where lower how to get to it. Okay, so we got to go to the upper decks because that will have a direct connection. Have you been touching all the crystals? Uh, I've only seen this one. Uh, there's a bunch of little ones around. Um, like if you look at your map, like the little blue crystals like this one, if you yeah. click those, those are like quick teleports through the city. So you can like click this one, then go to any other ones. So we got to go to upper. Um. So if we go to the aft castle, okay. So I'm gonna teleport. You probably don't have it, but you'll be able to see me on your map now. On I think where we got to go. Right. Lower. Yes. Okay. So I found where we got to go. Oh, look at you. Oh no, that's trying to. Maybe this was not the smart idea. Where'd you go? Or maybe you, did you find your way? Cause I can't find you on the map. No, I can't see you on the map either. Okay. I thought you were in the lower decks. Are you in the upper decks now? That's Trinant. Maybe it... Maybe you don't show up on the map unless you're on the same level. Let's see. Yeah, you're not going... You're going to want to go to the upper decks. You can't see... Oh! Can't, okay, so that's the reason. All right, so I'll come back down to you. That's, that's a bummer. Okay, so now I'm next to you again. So we need to go to upper decks. Okay. So we're going to go 
This way. And then there's some stairs. Aha! Got it. Yeah, the mapping thing took me a while to get used to, and I'm still get hung up on it. Okay, so we're up here now, and now we need to go to Lower Lamenza or Lower N Lanasia, right? Yeah. So we so we need to cut straight across. Yeah. Okay. So we're just gonna eat. Hey, it's training. Nosferatu. Whoa, and he just disappeared right in front of me. Oh, look at the snowman. Winter, how's it going, Frendo? Welcome to the stream. Got a lark while you study. I appreciate it. I'm doing just fine. We're just playing some Frendos. I hope you're doing well. Cool. So now your map should show things. Also, there's a fate right up here. We should go do that. Those okay. will those will help level up quickly. If you see any of these okay. purple icons in your map, those are what are called fates, and if they're your level, do them. They say they do some good experience. Neat. These are some of the things I have to kill, so I, we're in the right area. Oh, sure. the okay. So what do you need to kill? We can kill them on the uh, way. Three wharf rats, three little ladybugs, and three oh. Aurelia. I know the, the quest you're on. All right. Yeah. I stab. Stab. Purple thrust. Okay. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I'm gonna... I don't know if I can trade with you right now. Hey, I just leveled up. I can wear that stuff now. Split. Ten. Let's see if I can trade with you. Trade. Oh! Wait, is it because we just moved? Yeah, we can't do it because you're a free account. Bummer. I would have gave you a, some drinks, like food and stuff will give you bonus experience. So it's like always a good idea to have that bonus up. Um, okay, so... Oh, we can run to this as we're looking for things for you to kill. Do you need to kill these floaty oh, yes. dudes? Okay. Stab! Holy crap. Half the damage. And that music... It, oh, you... As we get closer... Is the, the fate music telling you you're in a fate. So we're gonna kill this big fly guy. Okay. Stab! And then when you're done with your quest, let us know and we can just run back with you. Nice. And this last dude. Come here. Yonk. There we go. I'm not naked. <laughs> oh, I got a new skill. Life Surge. Critical damage for the first weapon skill used. Okay, so I need to move that. Ooh, I have a heal spell. Cool. Which cannot be applied to damage over time. Absorbs portion of damage dealt as HP. Neat. Yeah, so that's all set with that one at least. Sweet. Uh, do you have any other ones in this uh, area? Not down here. No, not down here. Okay. Go ahead and lead on. Okay. Oh, I don't have a, a mount that you can ride. Damn it. Uh, how do I get out there? Okay, so we go just back up this way, right? Uh, I think so. Oh, 
You got a little boy. I didn't know you got a carbuncle so early. Kirby, yeah. I thought it would be, that would be like a hunter quest in WoW where you're going to be like, all right, got to be level 10. <laughs> go do a quest to go get him. Uh, Wait. This is the way back, right? No. Oh. <laughs> Other way. <laughs> uh, you need to go back to Limsa, right? Yeah. Okay. Back to the Arcanist Guild. Yeah, this way. How does your return spell work? Oh. I'm assuming it just teleports them back to the... Yeah, back to the main yep. crystal thingy. It should work. It's a... It's, it's a lot l shorter cooldown. I think it's only 10 minutes on this one. So... So, if you touch this baby crystal, at least you'll get this one. <gasps> nice. Okay, so now that's a, a quick port to this area, but we still need to go downstairs, which is this way. Unless you just teleported. Did you teleport? Nope. nope, I'm right here. I heard someone else. <laughs> 15, is that the, the cooldown? And then the Arcanist Guild is up to the left. Uh, yeah, this might be quicker. I don't know which way is quicker. I'm not sure either. Will we get in? Uh, if we go this way, we can pick you up a, a baby crystal at least. Yeah, 900 seconds. That, yeah, that's 15 minutes. Oh, I lied. It's not connected. Lied to me. Oh well. If you tune to the big crystal, you can teleport from baby crystal to big crystal. But you have to be attuned to the babies, though, right? I thought you did. Vicarious. <laughs> Vicarious. Now this will be this baby crystal. Oh. Will be the one that'll just essentially get you right here. Neat. Mud pets. Hold on a minute. Fuck, I'm naked again. Fuck, it's fine. It's fine. My pets from Lonnie. All right, why is you picking that up? I got a butt pet for the Jada. Get them to the 
my dude good morning bud pets did you just wake up oh snap how come you have a carbuncle and i don't <laughs> I figured, uh, whoa. If you're doing Arcanus and my Arcanus is low, we can do the same quests. Alright, so let's see. I also have to go back to the Drowning Wench, apparently. Oh, uh, that is here. And... I think that's upstairs. Yes, it's upstairs. Okay. Um, we might have a teleport up there. <laughs> uh, you got the aft castle teleport, right? Yes. So let's go teleport to that. You diddly did. Did you have good sleeps? And then this way. All right, this is the winch. Uh, there. Don't they? Oh, here. This is a heel. How it's easy to spot you out because you're not wearing any clothes. Yeah, I'm just here. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite embarrassing. I need more gear. So this dude wants me to go to Summerford Farms. Okay, so open up uh, your journal, and if you find your quest, it should. T and if you click on the map, it should tell you where we gotta go. That is. Uh, let's see. Middle Lanoskia. Okay. Let's leave through the Zephyr Gate. Oh. That was, uh, we were running through. Okay, so we gotta go back down. So we could probably just teleport to the Arcanist. There, that was weird. I can open it. Oh. If you, uh, if you click on the baby crystal, do you have Zephyr Gate? Uh, let me check. I do not. Okay. So I will just come to the Arcanist. 
If you click on the blue text on the quest tracker, it'll open up the map too. Oh, right. Forgot you could do that. You said you needed to go to the Zephyr Gate? Yeah. To middle? Through the Zephyr Gate. Yeah, middle looks like. Okay, actually, if we, we can go to the, the main Aetherite. It'll get us a little bit closer. Yep. You only get the gates when you click on all crystals in town. Gotcha. I don't think I've ever teleported to a gate, actually. All right. That was weird. I, t I showed up the other side. I just run by. It's like, I'm naked. They'll know. Alright, so this is the Zephyr Gate, I believe. Yep. Someone's name is Milk and Cookies. Ooh. What the fuck? Why is there fight music? Uh, we can go take out this fate. Oh, we, that's why. It's because the fate spawned on us. What level is it? Level 3. Okay. Oh, that big... Oh, no. Not no. that big thing, right? Nope. A flock of sheep is bitten by diseased bats have grown frenzied. Oh, okay, so there's... Oh, see these sheep with the purple on them? Oh, yeah, yeah. They need to die. Okay. Get him! Get him, Carby! Oh, that's a dot. Okay. What a weird-ass class. Oh, look at us all little baby levels here. More sheep? More sheep! Oh, I see him. The problem with being a, only having a dot cast right now is... Oh, it's not a dot. It just takes a while to cast. <gasps> I see you. I see you. Get him! Oh shit, I got the aggro of all three of them. Don't like! Oh, they're all up here. Go, Quetzalcoatl! I believe in you! I still can't wear gear. Fuck! We did it! Oh, there's another one. Horator Burning Bright. Oh, look at the big tiger! Oh, that thing's awesome! Whoa! Hello. Oh, shit. Summon Ruby. Ooh. That guy's cool. A Ruby Carbonacle, huh? I haven't seen this guy before. He's cool. This is a special event fate. Cool. I want to tame him. He's just jumping around. Stop it. Okay, so... Kennel the energy of your active elemental attunement to attack your enemy. Oh. I don't even know what the fuck is happening, dude. This is a weird ass class. I don't know what's happening either, to be honest with you. <laughs> okay, so that's a, a potency. Gem shine. Oh god. Surrounded by things. He summoned baby. I heal. Wee. Don't hurt me. Okay. 
It's okay, it hurt me. Boom! Heals! Nope. Don't attack me. Oh, I can do Ruby now. I summon Ruby. I don't know how I did that. So yeah, the orange stuff on the ground is danger probably. Yeah. Ruby Ruin. Okay. My skill bar has changed. No, 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 no. This is very interesting. Okay, so is the... Mm. Whoa! Someone someone did... Whoa! Well, that's cool. Yeah, that's really cool. I've never seen that. Trance gauge unlocked. Oh! I learned a thing. Okay. Okay, so wherever we gotta go, I can follow you. Okay. Trance gauge indicates... Right, let's see. We gotta go... Where are we? I gotta go in this direction. That is really cool, though. Yeah, i never seen that. That's really cool. It's a seasonal event fate. There's a quest for it in Upper, upper Lomans. Like, oh, neato. Very cool. Following the path is pretty safe, right? Ish. Oh, uh, yeah. Sometimes there'll be dudes right on the path, but for the most part, it should be okay. I'm naked minus the helmet. Yeah. I, I thought I bought gear, but apparently I can't wear it for some reason. It's just really cool. Wait a minute, I can wear that. There, I'm not so naked anymore. Oh, I can wear that too. Sick. Oh, oh okay, I guess it's all right. I'm not naked. Oh, we're in another fate? I guess. Nice. Oh, sick. Kill the boys! Oh, right. I'm not... the stabby boy anymore. Stay away! Oh god, they do not like me healing. I just took all this aggro. Ah! Oh. Oh. Chocobo, do some work, bro. Smack. Oh, thank god. Level saved me. <laughs> Did it. Get him, Ruby. Look, I got a red boy. I don't quite understand how it works, but I got one. Also, if you see like these little like yellow target things above them, Kill them, that means they're part of like it's called your hunting log. And it's oh, okay. per class. And uh you get bonus experience stuff. Neat. They look like little turnips. Yeah, the little green guys. <laughs> they literally just look like tiny little turnips. <laughs> Love it. B cloud, oh no. Dude, the fates are like spawning crazy here. Not the bees. The enemies have blue 
face things on the left of their nameplate, that means they're passive. Yes. You get a tiger helmet for that quest? Oh, we're going to have to go find that quest. See all the way up there. <laughs> oh, there's a thingy up here. Oh, yeah. Touch the crystal. That's something I always I still forget to do often. Oh shit! Guys exploding things over here. In the, in the wrong spot. Yeah, I'm in the wrong spot. I gotta go the other way. <gasps> Bonnie, you wanna see something? Look at the chonky boy fly! He's going for that cake. I love him. Ooh, this dude's gruff looking. that thing where's ah I don't think I like it there, but I'll play with it later. I'm surprised I don't have any quests here. I must have knocked them all out. See, I can't use these because it's not the right class thing. Huh. Oh my god, look at that chonk. Him a chonk. That big old chonk. <laughs> yeah, so you can use stuff that is specific to like your class or disciple of the something. Disciple of magic. Right? I think that's what it's called. I can't even take the next quest because I need... I am gear level five. Wow. Oh, uh, you should be able to. You're level seven. Unless it's requiring you to, like, if it says you have to wear something. Yeah, I have to have things. Really? Oh, your gear has yeah. to be level five. I got it. Yeah. Um, that's weird. You haven't gotten gear? No. That got you there? Um, also, if you open up your character sheet and you push this little blue thing it looks like a person sparkling um it'll bring up this little like or box that'll equip the best gear that you have for your level and then so do that that might help if not there's a vendor nearby with gear oh yeah, the, i may have to do that yeah there's a guy over here <laughs> yeah. oh. no fall damage no, well, no. Oh, okay, so no. there's fall damage, but it will never kill you unless you're in combat. Uh, okay. Then you can most certainly die. Where did I see him? 
I think he was over here. There's the mender. Here's... Sorry, I'm just trying to find him real quick, and then... I can, I can lead you to him. Where did you go? Near you? Oh. We're trying it. Oh, over here. We were literally right next to it. We just had to jump down like 10 feet behind. Jeez. Whoops. Oh, bad. Oh. Yeah, hopefully you might have enough money to buy some Let's stuff. See. Uh, it's battle gear? Yeah. Okay. I need some hands and some feet. I'm not going to have enough money. <laughs> Big yikes. I would give you some, but I can't. Because stinking... Well, let me... I like that there's things called hemp and kecks. A whole keck. Mm hmm. <laughs> I should just about to level eat stuff. Whoops. Well, I'm gonna get what I can. Yeah, it might get you close enough. Oh god, I look horrible. Let's see. Uh, look at your little pet. This thing is adorable. What the fuck is that? Looks like a Mario character. Can you stretch? Oh. Like a little witch hat. It's actually kind of cute. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Your outfit's cute. Mine's atrocious. <laughs> You'll get there, I believe. You look like a little witch. I look like I don't know what I'm doing. I'm trying to cosplay like seven different things. I'm a gardener, a dragon knight, and I got my oven mitts. I look like Zidane. <laughs> Who's Zidane? Or Zidane? Oh, that's what is that? Let's see if this does the trick. I don't know if it will, but we'll see. Uh, if you check your character sheet and in under or next to your gear set the thing next to the star will tell you your your gear level oh it's still just four fuck okay so we need a what piece of gear do you not have um let's see i mean the only ones that i have that are not just oh that's five that's five item level five what's bringing it down then Oh, probably because it's it's an average, so if you found another piece of gear. If Mr. Questman's quest face is green, you're good. Yeah, he wasn't green, I don't think. Still red. Oh, I see. Okay, so yeah, the pretty much everything except the hat and the shoes I just got are all level one. Okay. Yeah. What if you take off one of the level ones? Let's see. Will it change it? That'd be funny. It might. Final Fantasy IX protagonist was the Dane. Yeah, it doesn't actually change anything. Bummer. All right. Me um, is it? Are you just low on money, kind of thing? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Shit! How do we get money without doing quests? Did you find any more quests when we were running about? Uh, there's one that I'm supposed to, like, deliver a package to somebody, oh. but I don't know if that's gonna... Uh, that might. What do you gotta do for that? Uh, deliver the package for the dutiful sisters. 
Okay, where does the one you go for that? Five gil, but uh, that is back in uh, in Lamenta. All right, do you want to teleport? Uh, yeah. Oh. Uh, so if you use your return, it's free. It'll take you back uh, to your home. Teleport costs money. Hi. Oh, look, I can come with you. I forgot you could do that. That's awesome. If you're nearby someone when they're teleporting in your group, you can choose to go with them. all the wrong buttons. Oh, I have shit in an iron ore. I don't know why it's not letting me do bulk. It's late o'clock. Hey, thanks for playing, Trinit. It was fun. Hope yeah, you sleep well, my friend. with it later.
Boom. Blazed Cheerios. <laughs> She's cool. <gasps> Alcor. <laughs> person sweeping up a dead person. Man, the fucking gear in this game. There's some cool looking people. Yeah, that armor looked awesome. Saw blade. That is creepy. This person has an elephant head. Yeah, I was just looking at that. It's creeping me out. That's some Five Nights at Freddy shit. It's like Uncanny Valley. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be right back. You're good. Copper rings, soiled femur. Tiger ticket. Maybe we did get the quest done. That'd be kind of cool. So where's the... Where's the bell ringer? Femur copper rings. Oh, that's a bummer. Sorry, I thought I heard the cat knock something over downstairs. Oh, you're good. <laughs> Loud crash, bang, boom, not good. 
not good at all. Please. Steel ingot. I'll just die. Nothing to do with it. Oh, you're right next to me. Uh, I was, <laughs> I was just wait. I thought you were still doing deliveries. No. no. Uh, what do you need to do? Are you good with it? Uh, have to yeah the deliveries and stuff are all done um i need to do more stuff for the arcanist guild which requires us to go back to lower lanaskia okay we need to go oh we're gotta that's middle western oh we need to go up above that's right where's a oh there's a baby crystal over here And we go to After Castle. Right? I think. Looks like it, yeah. <gasps> hey, yo, I found that tiger quest! It's over here. I think we actually get credit for it because I was looking through my inventory and we got some weird tickets about a tiger. So if we accept it. Oh, oh it see. says this quest is not yet available for me. Oh, because level what? 15. Yeah, but I'm level seven. Let's see. OK, well, I have a cutscene. I, I actually have oven mitts on. <laughs> oh, he's telling me the story about the tiger. Okay, this is a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> I can I can get you quickly, so you can uh, run off ahead if you want. Okay. I'm skipping through this as fast as I can. What will you say? You bet. I slay tigers for breakfast. <laughs> sure. But I already did it. Fuck. He was a cool tiger. Can't we just make friends? <laughs> Aw, oh, bummer. Yeah, we I don't think we got credit for it. But I have these things. Where'd they go? There you go. Bummer. All right, I'm just coming to you. Did you go to that place that you were at? Yeah, it's a little bit further than that, but about the same. Okay. Oop. You went to lower, right? Or middle? Uh, lower. Okay. Come in. Oh, just 
fly over the sea. It's so fast. Boys! Monk. Can't fight two healers, sucker. Just gotta kill a bunch of these guys. Yeah, just one more of the little turnip men. Okay. character runs cute. She swings out her arms. Yeah. Even though it's probably just a default outfit, it is pretty cute. Mm-hmm. Very short skirt, though. I don't know if I like that. <laughs> a little bit chilly. At least with like the thigh high boots earlier, it probably would have been fine, but like now it's just like, uh, no, <laughs> the leg. Oh, uh, there's a fate this way. Oh, that thing's back. The big one. Cool. Big boy. It's up to you if you want to do it. I don't really. Does it give experience a second time? Yeah, it does. It's just like, um, I usually don't do fates the same fate multiple times because I think it gets less the first time you, you get like super credit and stuff. Yeah. Muffin got bleed. Thank you so much for the raid. How you doing? What? What were you playing? We're up, uh, we're up quite late. Thanks for the shout out. Moira's, uh, modding chat and playing the game at the same time. Legend. Three monitor flex. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where we're going. I should stop trying to run. I'm following you. Oh, you yeeted. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're playing some Dead by Daylight. Ooh. Are you a killer or a, uh, survivor main? How'd the games go? Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. Uh, we're just, uh, Moira is new to the game, so we're just kind of running around, showing them the ropes. But if you guys don't know me, I'm Vasif. I'm a variety gamer here on Twitch. Uh, Moira is also a streamer, but oh, you're not streaming right now, right? No, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, they streamed earlier. And, uh, but the real star of the show is that bean right there. That's Jada. She's the good pupper. She heard her name. That's Jada. She's, she's the real star of the show. We love her very much. Survivor all the way? All the way? You had a bad night? Oh no! Did you have, uh, campers? That always makes for a bad time. Also, I have a horrible outfit because I accidentally sold all my low-level gear. Because I misunderstood what the armory chest was about. So, that was fun. That's why I look like a, a hot mess. I look like I just walked out of the kitchen with my oven mitts and decided to go be a dragon knight in my high heels i didn't i just realized i'm wearing high heels that looks uncomfortable you're just bad at the game tonight oh i feel that i haven't played dbd in a hot minute the helmet you like the helmet oh it looks so awful though only reason i'm wearing it is because it gives bonus experience for level 10 and below <laughs> no lonnie rude also how do how did you find the stream if you don't mind saying Oh, yo. Is that a samurai? Can you be a samurai? Yo. Okay, there. Oh, look at Red Panda. Oh my god, I love him. 
I want a pet. Adorable. You think this helmet gives us like, like a plus 10 to ramming damage? <laughs> plus 2 to gore? Also, if you're leaving anywhere, let me know. I'm just kind of running around until you get your stuff done. Yeah, I gotta go to uh, back to middle. Middle? Boop the snoot! I just... I was not boopies! Oh, well, hold on. We'll give, we'll give you a kiss. Or a treat. I got some more for the raid. Um, yum, yum, yum. Eat them snack, homies. Ugh. What time is it? Oh, man. I thought it was later than 11. I thought it was like 1 in the morning or something. It's 1 in the morning. I was going to say for you it's 1 in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God damn it, Lonnie. What flexes? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, All the way down 10, there? Oh, yeah. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Whee. There you go. We've done 120 so far. Oh, you said you were going to middle. That's right. Oh, God damn it, Birch! <laughs> One, you gotta two, get them glutes three, toned, dude. Four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I teleport. Gotta get that cake. <laughs> You're all the way over there. Yep, I'm coming. Yo. Oh. Tree slugs. Gross. Dude, that tiger just keeps spawning. Are you fighting tree slugs? Yeah, it hurts. I'm here. Uh, you. Yucky. I don't care if you say this is a bot. All those things are linked. Okay. That little, like, yellow line that you see jump between them? That means, uh, like, if you attack any one of those, they all come. Oh, Zeus dismount. Not go down. See if this tiger's here. Oh, fuck. I should have checked like two seconds earlier because it just finished. <laughs> my baby heel didn't even show up on their life. Oh my god. Lonnie, thank you so much for contributing to the challenge. Happy clappies.
wonder how fast it respawns. Oh, you can just trigger it. Okay. Neat. Yep, it lets uh lets you know who's been contributing. Boy is back. You attack me, bro. No. Oh, new ability. Those are targets physical damage. Ooh. Okay. Marshmallow fluff. doing work. Oh, he's the dancer. Cool. Summoned. Or he died. That's probably the most likely. Thank you so much for contributing as well. Unkempt bacon. <laughs> Did not know bacon could be unkempt. <laughs> that sounds like something you probably don't want to munch on. Oh shit, just punched the shit out of the mic.
Ah, I can wear gear. I waited for you. <laughs> oh. I thought you had stepped away or something for a second. No, I know. That was Ricky Water, but. Now I gotta. Oh, did that dude uh, you get your uh, equipment level up enough? With that guy? Uh, I don't know. Oh, you just found another quest? Yeah. Gotcha. Trying to get money, I guess. Eat that bread. I gain that green. Is there... Oh, I can just... Whoa. The fuck... The fuck is that? Is that supposed to be a... It's a sword bow. <laughs> Oh my gosh, how cute. These pets are all so cute. <laughs> Blaze Cheerios is in the ramen guild. Love that. <laughs> that sounds kind of blurst. <laughs> Okay, that up is cute. Finally hit level five item. Nice. Good. Theoretically. Oh, you can't teleport to other like bigger crystals or. Uh, like in other cities. Yeah. You can. Um, it costs money to do that, though. Oh, oh okay. Because it wants me to go. Well, I have to go back to, like, the um, the dude at the farm. Yeah, so uh, you can. It's. It might be pretty cheap. Uh, so you can choose to spend money or you have to run it. Yeah. Uh, to do. Like, if you choose to spend the money, if you just open up your quest and click map, it'll show you where it is, and then you just click on the crystal. And, uh, it'll say confirm to spend the money, and then you're off. Oh, okay.
probably this seems like it's actually somewhat important quest and I'm not paying attention to it and I'm just choosing things so hopefully uh, nothing bad happens is oven mitts slash boxing gloves <laughs> apparently they said something really funny bye no idea what you guys said i used to read every one of the dialogues and then i was like that just takes too long i'll just do the main story stuff <laughs> Oh my god. Long ass quest. Wait, what? Oh. Shit. I don't want that. No. I changed my mind. I'm gonna drop that quest. Get out of here. Wait. Admin cakes. Whoa. That's it? Okay. <laughs> I guess. Muppy, thanks for hanging- Or thanks so much for hanging out. I can words getting late. <laughs> I appreciate you. Thank you so much for the raid. I hope to see you again soon. I'll definitely be going around checking you guys out. I hope you sleep well. Oh, you're over there. I'm coming. Oh, cool. It's like he's running in the air. Says to investigate. I am investigating. Oh. Uh, yours is down below. Here you go. I know that quest you're on. Oops, I should probably get off my mount. <laughs> down here. Ah, I see. Yeah, sneaky, sneaky. Oh, I see. Oh. I need to kill these boys. By extension, I think you do too. I have to summon my carbuncle every time? I hate that. Oh, because we're in a group. Yeah, sometimes uh, you can't be in a group with someone for certain quests. So there you go. Oh, that's a big ass lad. Oh, goodness. 
Goodness gracious, gravy me. What is that thing? Why do you have so many teeth, dude? <laughs> All the teeth. What the heck? What the heck? Holy crap, someone's loud. Oh my god, there are so many. Oh my god. In your little solo instance? Yeah. Oh god, these are some big honking boys. One's down, okay, cool. Sheridan. <laughs> the giant crab's name. failed oh i didn't know it was running out of time got here too late oh i just got two things what the fuck oh you have to let me know when you're out so we can regroup aether yeah. float oh my so god a weird cutscene you seen that energy drain fills the aether flow gauge which is required to perform certain actions fuck off Whoa. Okay. Arcanist is intense.
from cutscene prison. <laughs> <laughs> that was the long cutscene. I still think I'm in combat. It's annoying. Oh, I keep, like, I keep like looking at the map to be like, where are you at? We're not in a group. <laughs> All right, how much longer do you do you think you're gonna want to stay up? Because I know it's late uh, for you. This might be the last thing I do. Because yeah, it's, it'll be 2 a.m. soon. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I do have work in the morning. <laughs> Here, sir, Mr. Farmer, take your knife. Level nine. Nice. Flying motorcycle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they'll pretty much. What, what I do like about this game is like all the quests, essentially, it'll just lead you to exactly where you have to go to keep leveling. It's not like, oh, you finished everything in the series? Better go figure out where you go next. <laughs> Oh, unless you have to buy gear to, like, meet a requirements for a quest, I wouldn't buy gear. Oh, okay. That one was just unfortunate that we didn't have enough quests in to get more gear yet. Eventually, it just starts crapping gear out to you. Oh, yeah. I do think I might head to bed, though. All right. Uh, make sure you go to, like... Oh, this is a sanctuary. We're fine. We can hang out here. Yeah. <laughs> cool, because uh, you'll get rested experience, so. Oh, good, okay. All right, well, thanks for playing, man. Dude, we'll have to play some more soon. Hopefully, you had fun with it, so. Heck yeah, yeah. Thanks for showing me the ropes. Of course, there's there's a little more, but uh, the game's pretty good at teaching you stuff, too, so. Yeah. We'll get to it another time, but I hope you sleep well. <laughs> thanks. You, too, when you decide to get some rest. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably going to log out here and go watch some shows or something. Yeah. Right. Night, dude. All right, good night, dude. All right, my other friendos. Um, let's see. I do think this is where I'm going to call it. Let's see if uh, we have any friends that are streaming right now. Maybe we can go send some love elsewhere. Let's see. What do we got here? Of course, dude. We'll have to play some more soon. Uh, it's a fun game. Not too difficult. And I really like the aesthetics. The gameplay's fun. 
What have we got here? Actually, if I go for a raid, then I would have to hang out for a bit because I hate to raid and run. <laughs> overtime. This whole stream is a uh, overtime. Yeah, I've been streaming for almost seven and a half hours. Holy crap. All right, maybe we'll go raid this person. If sneaking, they're playing uh, Asmo. Go raid this person. I don't want to hear myself. Shush. Oh, they're playing Phasmo and they look like they're getting a little spooky. So let's go do that. Let's go raid them. Uh, their name is Audrey Cat. They look like they're having fun. So get your raid message out and ready. And you guys know how this works. But uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I hope you guys had fun. If you guys did, remember to like, subscribe, comment. It helps me out a lot. Let's me know what you're liking, what you're not liking. But more importantly, remember to spay new to your pets, adopt a little shop, donate to risk if you can afford it, or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and races out that are very much in need. Anyways, I'm Faceive. Thank you guys so much for letting me be your streamer today. I heavily appreciate it. Uh, might play some more again tomorrow. We'll see uh, during the day because I have tomorrow off. So maybe we'll play some there. And then uh, we'll play some more God of War. Oh, I need to check that that splitter works. But... I'll do that later, but thank you guys so much for hanging out with me, and I'll catch you guys over there. See ya. Jada, you hungry? Jada, you hungry? Come on. Come on. That was amazing. Okay, so <laughs> Mimic. Holy cow. Basim, thank you so, so much for the raid. How are you doing? <laughs> Lily Savage, you did do a scare. That was the scare. Indeed. Mimic, mimic, you're so right, assassin, you called it!